Hello. <clears throat> Hi, everybody. I haven't even posted. I haven't even added everyone in the Discord server yet. I haven't even posted. I tried bread without anything on it for lunch. <laughs> I had a burrito. It was really good. Here, hold on. I gotta, I gotta post the. I gotta post the announcement. Why? <clears throat> I got a question. Why does mobile Discord not alert me that I'm going to add like 300 people, but desktop Discord does? <laughs> That's the real question. I have to. I have to post the tweet, of course. Follow me on Twitter, by the way. Link in the description. Oh my god, it made me... Ugh, hold on. <laughs> I said follow me on Twitter, and so in my tweet I almost wrote, I'm live with Twitter. Alright. Hi everybody. Welcome, welcome. Good afternoon. Let's switch this over. Okay. Oh. There we go. It's so much easier to stream from an Elgato. Because I don't have to worry about... I don't have to worry about a lot of stuff. There we go. Right as you said hi, everybody, my cat meowed. I love it. All right, so I have a file, by the way. I am playing this in my free time, obviously. Uh, I'm on summer 11th only. I know it's not very far, but like, I have been enjoying it. We're on spring, th we're on the seventh of spring. And the reason that I had to stop streaming last time is because, fun fact, does anybody remember the internet problems I was having? <clears throat> because, that was city-wide, apparently. Like, that wasn't just me. That was, like, the entire city. Hold on. Now I have to... Now I have to remember what, like, what we've been doing. Right? Because we're on the 7th of spring. I have my makers over here. Okay. Hold on, I gotta turn this down. <clears throat> Lying a little sick in bed after my second vaccine. Thank you for biting my day with the stream. No, yeah, the Woods also said Thank you. Thank you for getting vaccinated, really. Okay, so because I have played on my own time, I do know, like, what I should be doing right now. I'm just kind of... Just kind of remembering what we have. I didn't build the barn yet, did I? Hello from Hong Kong. Hi. Hello. Hello from Canada. What's uh, one question I always love to ask people when they say hello from like really far away place? What's the weather in Hong Kong like right now? I love I love asking that question. What am I growing here? Why is there so little? Do I even have the No, I don't. Okay. Get these out of the, get these out of the way. Hello from Bermuda. Hello. <clears throat> oh, 
I'm dying. Why am I dying? Why have I got no? Why have I got no health left? So I do plan to stream all of town alongside A Wonderful Life until like Room Factory Five comes out. Um, I just I don't know when. Or sorry, did I just say Room? Wait. What did I just say? I plan to stream all of town alongside A Wonderful Life. Is that what I said? Oh my gosh. I'm just... I'm freaking out. <laughs> Can we get a poll? What should we eat for dinner? <laughs> uh, Do I need the white opal for anything? I'm going to keep the... Oh, is this literally... What have I been doing? I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna throw everything in here. I'm not gonna turn that into mayonnaise. I'm throwing this in there too. I don't want this. Wow. I don't. So one thing about all of town <clears throat> that I have noticed playing on my own is like you get, you get so many resources. Constantly, I don't think I've ever had a game. Especially like I don't think I've ever had a story of seasons or Harvest Moon game where I've had to. Like, like, just dump and empty and manage my inventory constantly as much as I do in this game. I don't I don't think I've ever had a Story of Seasons or Harvest Moon game where I just... It's just a constant inventory management system that I have going on. Does anybody else feel like that? Or is that just me? It's Clemens. Good morning. So, sorry to suddenly pop up at your door like this. The mayor asked me to come see you. That rain yesterday was something, huh? Oh, we're getting the... We're getting the bucket. I'd recommend using a bucket. Thanks, man. Thanks for the bucket. What's up, Pauline? PV. I was told to keep these flowers. Is that true? Am I going to need a lot of these flowers later on? I was told to keep all the flowers. Here, let's... I'm stuffy and sniffly and drippy and dying. What? Are you... What happened? You sick? Okay, I guess my next, like, my top priority is getting this done. Oh, we're almost there anyway. Three. It's weird to see all the, like, the wooden tools. We left the window open and Sam had the fan on blast, so I die. Oh, no. It is weird to have all the wooden tools. I just tried to charge this. Who are we marrying, by the way? I think, I think I'm going to marry Laura. Should I do that? Because I'm marrying Reyna in my main file, I decided. And I, I wanted I was either gonna be Reyna or Laura, so I think I might marry Laura in this file. If you guys are okay with that, we have to marry someone together, so we kinda have to decide together, you know? <laughs> but no, because like I I wanted to I might as well just do it in the stream file, right? Because I wanted to This tree's in my way. I wanted to marry Laura as well. Who is Laura? <laughs> Laura's the uh, the girl who works at the here look here here look I'll bring up her icon all right she's the she's the girl that look works at the uh, the the what's it called the port the b tourist boat thingy that's her Laura yeah I just got one get a notification Felix just donated five dollars and said chicken salad without lettuce and a cup of flat Pepsi or pizza without dough. 
with a shot of orange juice. Must eat with a spoon. Wait, how can you have pizza without dough? Do you literally just mean, like, the toppings? <laughs> like, on a plate? Chicken salad without lettuce. And a cup of flat Pepsi. You know what? I'm taking the chicken salad without lettuce. I'm taking the chicken salad without lettuce. That one's for, uh, for me. Sam! Hello! The smart idiot. <laughs> I like your name. Welcome to uh, welcome to Custom Emojis. Thank you so much for becoming a member. I hope you enjoy your your custom emojis. <clears throat> Hello from Germany. The weather is night. Yeah, you know what? Um, we have a patron from Germany. Uh, her name is Akima, and I, I used to start the stream at six p.m. Eastern instead of three. And uh, every time we would start the stream, she'd come in and say happy midnight. So I kind of want to get a happy midnight emoji <laughs> for members. I'm going to get a bunch of new uh, emojis and stuff. But I hope you enjoy the ones that are there for now. And uh, I'll update them very soon, I promise. But thank you so much for becoming a member. I appreciate it. <clears throat> I'm from France. So many people from different places. No, I don't want the silver right now, actually. I have 24... We don't need... Well, how much how much iron do I have? Iron ingots. I need 10, right? I need 10. <laughs> Regular lumber. Oh, it's because I only have three of these. Wait, why am I... Why am I making solid lumber? Do I need solid lumber for the... Now, now I'm all confused. Okay, it is solid lumber. Okay, so now we just need iron ingots. We need ten of them. Well, nine now. Hey, what's up, Roderick? Hello there. Okay, we got. I can't. I can't handle this. We got to make another one of these. I need. I need more. I need more lumber. Or just more logs. Wow, it really costs a lot to make the the ingot makers, doesn't it? I can go play my game, have a fun stream. Thanks for hanging out. I hope you enjoy. Cool, that's fine. We'll make at least one more. I forgot how expensive these are. My, especially the ingot makers alone, my production kind of slowed down with them. So like, uh, in my main pile. So I haven't needed more than like the four I have. So I forgot how expensive they are. Did you just destroy your cherry tree? Uh, yes I did. And the reason as to why I did uh, is actually quite tactful. It's because I... I forgot it was a cherry tree <laughs> until he said something. <laughs> I wasn't looking at my screen. I was reading the chat. I was <laughs> I just, just, I just completely uprooted my cherry tree. <laughs> I just completely destroyed my cherry tree. That's fine. Don't worry. I don't like cherries anyway. That's okay. <laughs> oh god, that's great. I wish you could dig up trees in this, like, Animal Crossing style. That would be cool. <clears throat> Did the same thing. Oh, man. Uh. Wow, yeah, I really just have to wait for the makers, huh? I should go to the mine. Here, I'll, you know what I'll do? I'll make more. I might, I, like, I actually might as well fill these up. They take so long. I might as well just fill them up even if I don't need something. Made it to a stream. Welcome. Hello. Cherry tree. <laughs> More like chopped tree. <laughs> Am I right? It's true. You like the music? What do you guys think about the music in this game? I've gotten to... I mean, there's the town music. I've gotten to... Beware of baddies. I've gotten to uh, summer. So, like, I, I've, I've heard the music from both. Let's hit him. 
Boink. Oh, he gave me some coal lump. Reminds me of Tree of Tranquility. Oh, I can kind of see that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I love Tree of Tranquility. And my, yeah, I, I like the my music too. It's really good. Except for the night town theme has mystery detective vibes. I don't want to pass out in here. Maybe I should just like look at the the game. <laughs> Sometimes I'm just looking at chat. I'm just like I'm just like autopiloting through the mine. You know what? I think we worked really well. I think we should go into town and eat something. Look at the squirrel. Oh, it disappeared. Okay. Roderick just donated two and said, take my Google Rewards money XD. And then he put the Wilder Heart. Where is... Where is Streamlabs? Oh, uh, Streamlabs? Hello? <laughs> no? <laughs> it's just... <laughs> okay. Thank you so much, Roderick. I appreciate it. Thank you for the rewards money. Oh, there we go. There's Streamlabs. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I'm selling these. I'm also just selling the egg. We, we don't need mayonnaise around here. It's fine. I need to make a I need to make a, a little bin. Let's make this. Ooh, Crystal just became a member. Welcome to Custom Emojis. Thank you so much. Enjoy your custom emojis and your butterfly. By the way, if you guys did not know, you can use the custom emojis in comments on my videos as well. So that's pretty cool. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Well, I need to I need to put what are we putting in here? I'm putting this, 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 this. You know, we might as well just throw this in this and this and this and this too. <laughs> just throw, throw everything I don't need in here. Yeah, welcome. Thank you so much. Yeah, your butterfly will change depending on how long you become a member. Or how long you stay a member. Yeah. The color will change. Uh, I'm fine. Let's go into town. <clears throat> Let's go talk to people. Hey, can somebody tell me what Laura likes? What gifts I can give her? Because uh, I want to I wanna be her friend. We got to be her friend first. How are you, Wilder? I'm good. I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing? I went out for a walk earlier today. It's freezing out, but like, it's cold. It, it's it's nice enough to where I don't need my winter jacket anymore. So I throw on like my my fall coat. Yeah, Zell and I went for a walk and it was really nice. How are you doing? She likes veggie juice. <laughs> Pauline just donated two dollars with a little with a what is the, what are those called? Are those stickers? With a little dog sticker. Thank you so much. <laughs> that dog sticker is cute. <laughs> I forgot that YouTube had stickers for donations. Or for super chats, I'm sorry. Super sticker. Oh. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. Thank you so much. The stickers are super cute. I think so too. Dude, Streamlabs is like really slow with that stuff. Hold on. What did, uh, who is Laura again? Here, I'll bring her picture up. There she is. That's Laura. I think she's really cool. How are you feeling about the game some hours in now? Uh, so in my personal file, I'm on uh, summer 11th. That's the furthest I've got so far. Um, I'm enjoying the game, but it it definitely has quite a few problems. A lot of them can be overlooked as long as like, you know, you can enjoy the good, the very good things that the game has, but a lot of them can't because they are like, they get in the way of fundamentals. That's where it becomes a problem. But like overall, I'm ha I'm still having a lot of fun. I'm gonna be playing this for quite a while. I know. <clears throat> Super sticker. I really want achievements on the Switch, Roderick. <laughs> I want. <laughs> oh, Roderick, that's so funny. Me too. Wait, I'm sorry. What does what does uh, what does Laura like? She likes uh. Someone said, where, hold on, I gotta sh scroll back up. 
Veggie juice. I don't have a I don't have a kitchen yet. That's what we should focus on after the barn as well. Fashionable bracelet? Sunflowers and tuna. Huh? <laughs> Laura likes it when you flaunt your wealth. <laughs> I, I got no money. <laughs> she I I have no money. Is she over here right now? Yes, she is. She's here. Hi. I don't know if that's down to be the most happening place around. So we bring in more tourists. What if I talk to her over the desk? Register for a trip. Your avatar will visit other players' towns all over the world. If you leave communication features turned on, farmers all over the world. You can visit other people's towns. So by sending out a postcard, you can share a photo you've taken with farmers all over the world. Okay. Hold on. Is this like Animal Crossing visit their town? Or is it like, is, is it like Dream Suite? Is it like, is it like New Horizons go to someone's town? Or is it like Dream Suite? Like, is it more like a Dream Suite thing? You can't actually visit towns. Just random bots show up? What? It's just your avatar can show up in someone else's town. Really? Hey. Register for a trip. Not registered. Huh? <laughs> Upload the registered information to the internet. What? Upload? Sure, yeah, why not? I don't care. Make it public. <laughs> hey, look, it's me! Okay, so then... Then I can appear on my friend's farms? Or is it anybody's? You visitor log. Well, I don't have any visitors. I just did it for the first time. Wait, what? Huh? Oh, wait. Is this actually other people's characters that they made? Oh, that one's cute. Are these actually, like, other people's characters? Your avatar can show up as a tourist in other people's towns. Those are the tourists? Because, like, I was playing earlier, right? And I saw... I saw, like, a tourist, and it was just, like, my character almost exactly. And I was like, wow, they just kind of reused this, didn't they? Th but, like, those are actually other people that they, like, made. That's so cool. Pauline says, can you Fortnite dance? Yeah. You gotta unlock it, though. It's a skill. Look. <clears throat> Do you see the one at the, on the just under orcharding? See how the one under orcharding is locked? It's dancing. When you get that to max level, uh, you can Fortnite dance. Hey. <laughs> it's it's great. <laughs> when you register a postcard as a picture, you choose to show up in the game as a loading screen. Oh, that's how you do that. Okay. Very cool. <laughs> 150 viewers and only 36 likes. You're right, Felix. You're right. Hey, everybody. If you're watching... Hit that like button. I appreciate it. It helps a lot. Oh, thank God. Look at all this stuff I let, like, pile up here. Oh, wow. They're basically all metals. I mean, I'm not going to complain. I liked don't at me. I will not at you. at you anyway. <laughs> I was just thinking about how good your last stream of this was, so I got to... So glad I got to catch it live. Cool, thank you so much. I'm glad you enjoyed the last one. I plan to stream this until Room Factory 5 comes out. I said that before, but like, I do. I do plan to keep up with it. We're gonna at least get married in this game. Because like, all the past games we streamed that hasn't been a wonderful life, we haven't got even gotten married. So like, you know, um, I plan to at least we're gonna we're gonna at least get married. Right, I was going to eat something. Let's go eat something. Why not? Look, <laughs> the rat dog emote is still here. Hi there. Have fun with the rat dog emote. It's going away soon. At some point, I'm eating some pizza. And apparently, all, everything except pizza. Like, see all that stuff. Or was that pizza in a bowl? <laughs> we 
<laughs> rip game. Because <laughs> the, uh, the rat dog emote uh, is... I just, if it kind of like, it doesn't have like as much of a purpose as it did before, and uh, we can get, we can, we can give a, we, I, I don't mind having like the emojis that always stay, like the witch princess lol, I like that one, but uh, certain emojis like rat dog, we can always like cycle out for whatever game we're playing or whatever makes sense. For anyone who loves the uh, A Wonderful Life streams, I want to replace the rat dog emoji with one of Lucas, so that whenever Lucas tries to destroy my life and my farm. Everyone can just spam the Lucas emoji. <laughs> I think that would be cool. <clears throat> wow, I just tried to, I tried to charge the the watering can again. <laughs> but Doug is gonna be back in Roof Factory 5. You're right. But he's not a he doesn't look rat anymore. Pauline's the one who came up with rat Doug. Pauline, what do you think of what Doug looks like in Room Factory 5? That's the real, uh, that's the real test. <laughs> yes, he is not, he's not rat anymore. I like how I took the chicken out at the end. Hold on. Barn first, then I'm gonna make the... Oh, wait. Oh, it's because I put all the... I was like, where did all my solid lumber go? It's because I put it in the box. Duh. We're gonna do the barn first, then we're gonna upgrade the house, is I think what I want to do. Margaret should have stayed the same. I mean, she's an elf. That's true. People got mad at me because I, I said... I didn't elaborate in my video when I said Margaret's face definitely looks different, and I was trying to figure out if it took away from her character or not. Uh, what I meant was, like, like Margaret from Room Factory 4 had more character and personality in her face than she does in 5, and I, I didn't elaborate on that, so, like, it didn't sound like I said that, so people got mad at me, but uh, if you're one of the people that was wondering, that's what I meant. Doug... As well, to some extent, you can see that Doug lost some personality in his face too, but like, it just, it fits him so much because of his, like, his entire, like, presence changed from, from Rat Doug to, like, what he is now. <laughs> the real ones, no. <laughs> they just made her faces longer. Long equals age. I mean, I don't know. Ask the developers. They're the like the developers are literally the ones who said on the live stream that they they look older. So that's what I'm going off. I mean, yeah, to some extent, when you like mo start moving facial features around in certain ways, whether the faces get longer or not, it will. Like, people will look at it and be like, oh, it, they look older. It's just growth, you know? Long rat duck. <laughs> now I just gotta wait, I guess. I don't want to build another one because, like... There's two. Hold on. Hey, there's eight. And then, okay, that's ten. Easy. Doug, but not rat. Evil idea. Just, just Doug. <laughs> why, why, why just Doug? I wonder how many years it's been in Room Factory Four. Yeah, yeah. I want to know how long it's been. <laughs> Room Factory Four Five. Everyone is saying because Doug's in, uh, in Rig Bar. What happened to Blossom? <laughs> so now I really want to know how many years it's been. Yeah, I'm still in the tent. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, build a barn up first, and then I'm gonna upgrade the house. Okay, now I'm gonna go grab this.
I did we did we say last stream? You're not selling the coins. Thank you for reminding me. <laughs> did we say last stream that we were naming the barn Mootopia? Was that what we decided on? Where did you get the coins? If you go into the uh, the Olive Town Hall, where the mayor lives, uh, there's a green box in there, and every time you like get like. Every time you make milestones in the game, you, you can get rewards, and they're all different types of things. The coins are just stuff you can sell. Do we agree with Mootopia? Yeah? Okay. <clears throat> this is Mootopia. Fun fact, in my personal file, I named this Mootopia because of you guys. Because I did not know what to name the bar, and I was like, Mootopia is pretty good. Alright, let's move the cow in here. What are we naming the cow? Was it Bubble? Was it Bubble Cow? Was it Bubbles? What was it? Does anybody remember? <laughs> yeah, wait, yeah, wait, what? Where's the... <laughs> what's that, what's that cat in a box emoji? Was it Bubbles? Okay, I'm gonna name it Bubbles. I couldn't remember. Cause it's like a bubble cow. <laughs> Alright, let's uh let's go check it. Okay. Why don't you come outside, bubbles? <laughs> Meat. <laughs> We're doing this again. <laughs> I have so many rewards piled up. Yeah, did you just like what did you just check them now? <laughs> if I if I literally d didn't have everybody telling me from like the start that that was there, I probably it would have been a very long time until I figured out it was there. Did I call the chicken out? Come on out, chicken. Yeah, you use a little tiny hammer on the bell when you uh, when you call them out. Okay, what do I need for the house? <clears throat> what do I need for the house upgrade? Look, it's Reyna! <laughs> Shutterbug donated $5 and said, We must name one barbecue in reference to Harvest Moon Wonderful Life Stream. No, wait! The barbecue reference was, uh, the barbecue was from Animal Parade. Somebody donated for me to name one of the cows barbecue in Animal Parade. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you for the for five. I'm gonna, I'm gonna name one. The next cow we get is named barbecue now. That's how, that's how it works. Alright, thank you so much. I appreciate it. What's up, Nigel? I need to I need to expand my house. Easy. What? Are you serious? That's it? Just 20 logs? I'll be back. I'll be back before you close. One sec. Hold up. Wasn't that Pauline? I th I th I don't think so. I can't remember. You clay from the puddles. Yeah. You have to unlock scooping. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Um, I've I really like the aesthetic of the brick walls, but it just takes so long to get so many bricks. I re I really really just want to fill the makers. Hold on, let's upgrade. Let's actually get a house, shall we? I'm tired of living in a tent. What is this Animal Crossing? Let's 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 get a. How long does it take for trees to regrow? Once they're actually like sprouting. I believe it's like only two days after that, isn't it? I don't know how long it takes them to actually come back, but like it's really, really quick. 200 plus bricks for the greenhouse. Thank you. I will not make brick walls now. <laughs> I'm just gonna hoard bricks. Wow, 200? Really? 
Is it better to donate through Streamlabs or through Super Chat? Like, does one take a portion of money? Uh, if you donate to me through Streamlabs, uh, I'll get all of it. If you donate through Super Chat, YouTube takes 30%. Unfortunately. <laughs> it's it's easier uh, it's easier for Super Chat, and Super Chat's more convenient. But uh, Streamlabs is... Yeah, that's how it works. I appreciate both just the same, though. <laughs> oh, Zell just says without getting into it, Streamlabs. Eyes emoji. <laughs> this is your grandpa's farm, right? Where did he sleep? I don't know. Maybe like, maybe like one of these buildings that are destroyed was actually his house. And I'm like, oh, a barn! And he's like, oh, thanks. Yeah, I built that house with my bare hands. Nice. And it's totally a barn. Maybe he's just mad. <laughs> There's a greenhouse? Yeah, is it, is it on the third part of the uh, farm? How to donate through Streamlabs? There's a link at the top of the description that should say you want to support the stream? Uh, donate here. And that's the, my Streamlabs link. Yeah, I mean, zero donated fifty. Oh, fifty dollars. Okay, now I understand the question. Said so thank you for all the content you've made. It always makes my day. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> hey, thank you so much. Like honestly, I I I just thank you. You're the best. That's a lot of money, by the way. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Wow. And like the whole like thank you for the content. Thank you for watching. That's why I make it is because like you guys always watch watch it. So I'm going to keep making it as long as you're there to enjoy it. Thank you so much. That's a lot. That's a lot of money. <laughs> thank you. That's awesome. <laughs> now I understand the question. <laughs> oh, my God. Now I'm kind of sad that, like, I, Streamlabs won't put... Because you know how when, when somebody donates through Super Chat, it, like, pins their name at the top of the chat for, like, however long they've donated? And, like, the, the or the length it's pinned is, like, how much they donated? I kind of wish Streamlabs would do the same thing now, because, like... That's a lot. That's a lot. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. I thought that said $5, so I was, like... I was just reading it casually, and then I was, like, 5 $50. Just, just thank you. Truth, like, actually, thank you. That's, uh, you're awesome. <laughs> I appreciate it. Grandpa was raised in a barn with how messy. Sorry, I gotta scroll up chat now, because I, <laughs> I was too busy freaking out. Third layer. It's called something other than greenhouse. What is it? What is it called? I probably seen it then. I just need logs, right? I'm good for logs now. I should be. Okay, hold on. What? No, okay. <laughs> so now Mizuru donates a hundred dollars, right? And get this, says okay. Now I'm done. <laughs> Dude, okay. You should have enough for a barn. I have enough to buy a barn now. <laughs> okay. I just joined. Hi, well, welcome. Mizuru just donated $50 and then $100. That's $100. That's, that's $1, by the way, for every person that's on watching the stream right now. That's a lot. That's a lot of money. Thank you so much. What do I, what do I say? <laughs> like, what do I, thank you. That's not ten dollars, yeah, I know. <laughs> I thought the fifty was five. <laughs> At first. Thank you, man. I I just I I just I'm a broken record now, but like I really genuinely do appreciate it. That means so much to me. Use it to buy at least one sandwich. This is my only request. I will definitely buy a sandwich. Shutterbug just donated twenty five dollars and says, just because I love y'all. Kitty face. <laughs> Thank you, Shutters. I appreciate it. Storm Cloaks. Wait a minute. 
that's a nice reference. I appreciate that reference. Actually, you know what? Neither. You know what? True. That's true. <laughs> Neither. I'll just, uh, I'll just, I'll just play. I'll just go on my own. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you both. I don't want to upgrade my, I'm, I'm in the wrong house. I'm not even... <laughs> Y'all are popping tonight. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you. Yeah. Can everybody, by the way, for uh, all my members, can you guys all spam the Wilder Heart emoji, please, for uh, for both Mizuru and Shutterbug? Please. Thank you guys so much. Everybody give them Wilder Hearts. I would say can't keep up with that donut, but now there's fun. <laughs> thank you so much. Look at all the Wilder Hearts. I just, at risk of repeating myself again. I just, I appreciate, I appreciate it so much. And then Samichu comes in and donates 30 and says, Hi, me and Pao love you so bad. I love you guys too. Thank you. And then, <laughs> whoa, 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 hold on. Corrupt Concubines donate Super Chats 50 and says, I look forward to your future streams. P.S. Your chuckle makes my day. <laughs> okay, th cool. There's another chuckle for you. Thank you so much. Guys, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, holy crap. Zell, Zell wants to say something. Hi, guys. I just want to thank all of you so much for how sweet you guys are. You, like... Look, with, oh all, my God. with all your donations, we we bought a house. Check it out. Nigel b built us a house. Oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just... I couldn't ignore it. I just... You guys are so sweet. What the hell? <laughs> Pog. Um... <laughs> You know, just remember to like the stream, and I'll see you guys in Discord. Oh, yeah, Zell comes to say thank you and plugs the stream. Plug, 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 plug. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll leave you alone now. <laughs> thank you guys so much. Oh, my God. Okay, well, we have a house now. Check it out. Interior decoration. Oh, yeah, we can decorate now. Cammy posts the muddy little, the little muddy tongue emoji. <laughs> okay, so now we have the fridge and we can cook and we have the house pog. <laughs> I need to make a little pog emoji now. Um, so, why did my string lights going off again? Annalyn super chatted $10? Wait, wait. There we go. Wow, Streamlabs got to that before YouTube. It says, hey, can I donate too? You definitely can. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hell yeah, you can, says Mizuru. <laughs> yeah, I can get a pet now, too. We should get a pet. Thank you guys so much. What what pet should we get? Should we get a dog or a cat? Oh, here's the war. Hold on, I have a question. Um, If, when I put, like, put... Wait, didn't we buy a candle for... Didn't we buy a candle for the house? Mooncase Streamer just donated $50 and said, Donation Train. Thanks for the premium farming sim content and more always. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, dude. Oh. Okay, can I can I be honest with you guys? I had a really rough night last night, and I had a really rough day today. And I was like, you know what? I really do want to stream, but I also kind of wouldn't mind if I didn't stream. And <laughs> you get like, that's... I... I I appreciate all the love. I really, really do. Thank you so much for the donations, but thanks so much for, like, the really nice, encouraging words. I love you all. Both? Everybody's saying dog? Okay, we're getting a dog. I make the mornies take it. Thank you so much. Hold on, I gotta, I gotta play. I've been, I've just been pausing. I've been so distracted. Okay, um... This is awesome, I love this. Me too, it's so cute. What about a kitty? We'll up- we'll get a dog, and then we'll upgrade the house, and then we'll get a kitty. So while my stream is going off again, Thornbrains donated $15 and said, Yo, have a dime for every person watching. Ignore if I can't count. Thank you so much for the dimes! That's a lot of dimes, by the way. <laughs> Thank you! Dude. I just... <laughs> Hold on, let's go get a dog. We're going to get a dog right now. You can have four pets, so you can have them all. 
I can't give hugs with my big arms, so I give money hugs. Sounds awful, but you know what I mean. Jazz with Lovely donated, super chatted $2 with the, oh, so I'm sorry, super stickered. Is that what it is? Super sticker? $2 is the dog with the hearts. Thank you so much. All those dimes. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of dimes. Oh, you guys are the best. Like, I just, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say anymore. Thank you so much. Oh, she's giving us the leash. I'm broke. I'd love to donate, but I can't until I get a job. That's okay. I appreciate the thought. Trina was going off again. Oh, no. That was, oh, that was the late one. <laughs> Thank you again for that. I love the little dog. We're getting a dog now, by the way. Save my donos for after my thick boy box ships. I'm so excited. Thank you for sending that too. I'm so excited. Okay, we got another super chat. Devin Lauda donates uh, super chats fifty dollars. There's no message, but thank you so much. Please, yeah, please come into the Discord so we can thank you again, all of you, <laughs> if you're not part of the Discord. Thank you so much for that super chat. Oh my god. Hold up. Uh, I gotta buy a pet. Oh, there's Streamlabs. Dude, Streamlabs is like slow and fast. It doesn't matter. Wait, what are we getting? Are we getting a? Are we getting? So in my file, I got the uh, I got the Pomeranian. Shutterbug a super chest, another ten dollars, or super stickers, with the dog, and the heart. Thank you so much. That one's really cute. I'm pretty sure the total is up to four hundred and one dollars donated. I I I don't know. I lost count. Hi, Walter. Hello, everyone. Hello, Nov Novikov. Hi. Welcome. <laughs> uh, in my file, I got a... I got a Labrador Retriever. I named I named it Stella. What was that? that? Okay, that was the Super Chat again. Thank you, guys. App, like, genuinely thank you. It's... I, so, I appreciate it so much. <laughs> Can we make it for 20, though? <laughs> Can't watch the stream right now, but I hope you enjoy the game. I am definitely enjoying the game. I hope you have a wonderful day. Thanks for popping in to say hello. I appreciate that. Burmese Mountain. You know what? Maybe I'll, we will get the Bernice Mountain Dog, because I really like it. Pomeranian. Bernice Mountain Dog. Okay. I think I want the Bernice. Am I doing it? Okay, what do we name it? What are we naming it? I need a name. You guys, you guys, I'll pick a name. The next cow name is taken by Shutters. It's gonna be named Barbecue, but we can name the dog <laughs> a Husky. <laughs> Just name it Husky. Fried chicken. <laughs> you know, okay. You know what? You know what? Missouri started all this, uh, this, this, this hype donation train. So I think it's only fair. That I actually named this dog fried chicken. Can I fried chicken? I can do N or I can make it all one word. What would you prefer? <laughs> would you prefer this or all one word? I'm actually I'm naming a Bernese Mountain Dog fried chicken. <laughs> Just N, okay. <laughs> it's fried chicken. <laughs> Thank you so much for all everything let me just donated five dollars so thanks for streaming glad to have found your channel oh thank you for watching i'm glad you found my channel too it's a, uh, it's been a lot of fun i love my community so much thank you uh thank you for watching <clears throat> all right fried chicken is we own fried chicken We have a Bernice Mountain Dog named Fried Chicken. Let's go. Let's go see him. Welcome, Fried Chicken. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Arf, arf. All right, let's take Fried Chicken for a walk. Good dog. <laughs> The house is big. Yeah, this is the... You can upgrade the house again, right? Oh, yeah. Someone told me that you can put the leash back in the tool bag, and it, you'll still be on a walk. But then you have to you have to actually take the, the leash out again to stop the walk. Uh-oh. Fried chicken's stuck. 
<laughs> Don't eat enough. We summon Zell from the other room. It's true. The, yeah, the, yeah, the leash doesn't show. So you can like you can just equip something different, and the dog will still follow you. I actually really like it. It's pretty cute. <clears throat> yeah, I love how you can take them for a walk. It's really nice. The Verde's Mountain Dog is really cute. Oh, I did not put food for bubbles. Thank you for reminding me. Hold on, let's go get something. These, I need to water. I held the, I held the button again. <laughs> oh, the puppy's happy. You see that? Yeah, I don't have anything in here. Let's go buy some stuff. Come along, fried chicken. We're going into the town. I'm on my way to work right now, so I can't watch the stream, but I love you like a brother, and I hope you have a good stream. Thank you so much, Sammy. Thanks for your donation. I hope you have a good day. I really do. Uh, are we going? We're running here. I like how your dog waits for you outside, too. Love you like a brother. <laughs> What's up, Jack? You got something funny to say? Man, the afternoon goes on forever. That wasn't funny. <laughs> Love you, Sam. <laughs> hey, let's let's just buy some fodder. I'm already growing stuff anyway. Let's buy let's buy ten. There, easy. Wait, <clears throat> it was Smoo, right? I asked Smoo in the Discord. If you buy the ball for your dog and throw it, it's one time use. Cause I lost the ball. Like I threw the ball, the dog brought it back, and it was gone. And I asked Smoo, I was like, "What the f what happened to the ball?" And Smoo said it was it was one time use. I can't go this way, the dog will get stuck. <laughs> yeah, the ball is consumed. <laughs> he ate the ball. <laughs> I'm, I'm just gonna fill this. I, I prefer to have them filled anyway. I have to go back to work in a few. Oh, thank you so much for everything, Shutters. I appreciate it. I hope you have a good day. I hope you are having a good day. Rabbit ate my ball. Shame this time around, there's no witch princess. Oh, I know. Everyone spam witch princess lol. Well, don't, I mean, just just put it. Don't spam it. But, like, everyone do the witch princess lol. I love it so much. I got here, that's a big dog. Yeah, it's a Bernice Mountain Dog. It's very cute. His name is Fried Chicken. <laughs> With no E. <laughs> okay, let's, let's process more of these materials. I love seeing story of season stuff, but I get sad when I think of Rune Factory 5 not having a North American release date yet. I swear to you, the day Rune Factory 5 comes out, I'm going to be streaming that for like five hours straight. I, I just... We were almost at three hours for all of town, and I didn't want to stop. I had to because my city was having internet problems, but like... Oh my gosh. Kaylee Hunter super chats $20 and said, I started playing Story of Seasons and the old Harvest Moon games because of you. So thank you for making videos on them. No problem. Thank you for watching. I'm glad that I could uh, introduce that to you. Thank you so much for the super chat. Only five hours? JK. And then I'm gonna yeah, then I'm gonna log off of the stream and go do my personal file. <laughs> thank you so much for the super chat. I appreciate it. Thanks for watching the videos. What uh what which uh like what videos was it one of the newer videos, or was it like an old stream? Or sorry, was it one of the like update videos of news coming out for your game, or was it the streams? Like, what made you want to pick them up? I'm interested. Can you cook? Also, what's the next goal? I guess the next goal should be uh, getting the third part of the farm unlocked. Yeah, the rest of the world, North America just has 2021. Is it still this year? Yeah. Japan's get when is Japan getting Room Factory 5? May, right? Look! Look at him! He's in the rock! What is he doing up there? Come down here. He was in the rock. May 20th, yeah, okay. Uh 
or May 2021. So what's this gonna be? Solid lumber, silver ingot, and mortar. Okay, that's that's kind of easy. Let's get the solid lumber going already, and then we'll uh, upgrade the hammer so that we can have an easier time getting the silver ingots. The Harvest Moon Wonderful Life live streams. They're easily my favorites. Oh, nice. Those are some of my favorites too. I'm not gonna lie. Doodle Bob. Toodle Bob just donated ten dollars and said, "I love your streams, Wilder, and you just make me happy watching you. Keep doing what you do. Thank you so much. You make me happy because you watch the videos and the streams. Honestly, I appreciate it so much. Here, let's end the walk with the dog now. Thank you so much for the donation. I appreciate that a lot. I'm glad that you like the streams. I remember when I, <clears throat> I remember when I first. So, when I made my first Room Factory video." And I started to get, like, because when I made my first Room Factory video, I was at, like, 26 subscribers, I think. And then I made the What I'm Hoping For for Room Factory 5 video. And then, like, everyone just kind of started to flood in like crazy. And I remember I made my second video, then I made my Thank You for 100 Subscribers video. And I remember thinking, like, I would love to stream. And I think streaming would be awesome and fun to talk to everyone while I play. Um, but I don't think anyone would be interested in watching me stream. Because, like, I'm not a big YouTuber. You know what I mean? And so I, I went to the Discord, my Discord, when it was just little. When it was just babby Discord. And I was like, hey, would you guys be interested in watching me stream Room Factory Frontier? And everyone was like, please stream Frontier. Please. And I was like, okay. And so I did it. And I, Zell was on stream with me. And that's when everybody met Zell. And it was just, it was a lot of fun. Okay, how do I make this again? This is just this is just clay. Okay, <clears throat> that's easy. So we're gonna. S this is regular lumber. I don't need to make regular lumber right now. When they make another Harvest Moon remake, which game would you want it to be? I want them to remake A Wonderful Life, but I want it made to look like A Wonderful Life, not like All of Town. Nothing wrong with how All of Town looks. I just I want it to look like A Wonderful Life. I basically want them to take a wonderful life. I want them to add a bunch of Harvest Moon DS mechanics to it. And I want them to make it look like a wonderful life, but with like better textures, better lighting, you know, stuff like that. But I want them to keep the same atmosphere of it. You know what I mean? That's what I want from a wonderful life remake. And I know that's like way too much to ask, especially for like, for the story seasons, but like, that's what I want. All of Town could have easily been in 3D. It makes me sad. Yeah, like I was talking last stream when I took out the camera for the first time. Look at this. Look at this. Look at how awesome this is. What's what what's wrong with this? I mean, yeah, the draw distance. But like, what's what's wrong with this? Honestly, can someone tell me? I mean, not first person. Like, if this was third person and the draw distance wasn't this bad. Like, look at how cool this is. You know how awesome this would be? Anyway, maybe that's just, you know, but... Yeah, the free camera being the default camera would be really cool. Okay. I gotta I gotta go up the gear. I have to upgrade the hammer before we do anything else. By the way, hey, if you haven't yet and you're here, hit that like button. Like the stream. It helps me a lot. I appreciate it. Thank you. Let's put that in. Uh, you know what? I'm so <laughs> who needs peppercorn? <laughs> who need, who needs who needs peppercorn? Let's go to sleep, and I hope we make enough money to so I can go get an iron hammer because I need one. I made it to poop the stream. Hello, Wally. Hi. Welcome. Okay. Yeah. Easy. We made sixteen hundred. Nice. My favorite memory is when I was stuck at home recovering from pneumonia and I'd sit in a big comfy chair and play A Wonderful Life while the sun rose. It was so peaceful. A Wonderful Life, I think, is the only game that has ever, because of the lighting, 
uh, made me feel like I was actually outside in the morning as the sun was rising, like as the light was coming in. Like it, it actually made me feel like I was outside in the morning, even though it was like 9 p.m. and I was playing like in my room or whatever as a kid. The atmosphere is just something else in that game. It's really good. I must go by everyone. Bye, Shutters. Thank you so much for all the donations and super chats. I hope you have a wonderful day. I need more clay. Let's start taking out some of these puddles. I got excited. <laughs> Yeah, Wonderful Life makes me excited too. I don't know when I'm going to stream a Wonderful Life next, but it's going to be sometime soon because it's been a while. I just want to play more All of Town first. And then we'll switch between the two. We'll alternate between the two, I guess. If you know who you're going to marry yet. In my personal file, I'm currently on the almost ready to... Uh, I'm like halfway there. I'm going to marry Reyna. And in this file, I am going to marry Laura. Which I should probably... You know what? I should probably actually go talk to Laura. <laughs> Once in a while, shouldn't I? <laughs> that might be a good idea. He's doing Wilder. Are making me want to buy the game y'all are mentioning. It's yes, yes. <laughs> if you if you haven't seen much from it, uh, I have a playlist on my channel. It's my Harvest Moon: A Wonderful Life Let's Play. The Let's Play started uh, when I had like six subscribers, and now it's turned into streams. So if you're interested in seeing Harvest Moon A Wonderful Life, uh, go check it out. Go check out the playlist. You can watch the Let's Play and see if it's for you or not. I I recommend it, as long as you're okay with the... Like, it's an old game, and it's quite a... It's, it has quite a, a lack of content in a lot of areas, but it makes up for that with its feel and its atmosphere, in my opinion. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna take out that entire puddle, giant puddle. Oh, hey, Holy has the Streamlabs link. Oh, that makes it much easier. Thank you. Oh, yeah, there's the playlist link if, you, if you're interested. Zell just posted it. <clears throat> yes, I, so, no, I haven't finished Wonderful Life yet. I do plan on beating A Wonderful Life on stream. We just started chapter three, which is the longest chapter in A Wonderful Life. It's uh, three years long. So, like, as soon as we get past that, we're basically, like, almost on the game. <laughs> but, yeah, I, we're going to, I'm going to beat it. We're all going to beat it together on, on stream. It's going to be great. Because that game actually does have an ending. Bubbles the bubbly cow. Yeah, I'm. That's what I named it. Here, let's go. Let's go into town now. Wait, I gotta grab this A solid log, please. Wait, do I even have enough iron? Oh boy. Nope. I'm gonna do that really quickly then. Let's go to. We're going back to the mine, boys. Yeah, there are chapters. So in A Wonderful Life, uh, there's seven, seven chapters, and they're each a different amount of years long. And uh, once you get past the chapter, things change. Example, uh, in the first chapter, it's one year long, and um, you have to get married. If you don't get married at the end of the first chapter which is the first year, then the, the girl who has the most affection for you will come and propose to you. And if you say no, then you are you go back to the title screen and you got to reload. <laughs> um, and it's because the game, instead of following the, like, um, the, the traditional, um, like, rules, I guess, uh, it's, it has, like, a storyline it follows, and it's just the, your entire life. So every chapter people in the town get older they start to age and your character looks older too um, the game is actually very long and because of how long it is uh, it, it you can see the lack of content but I think it's it's pretty great 
I'm gonna predict that we find out that Tartan is your son from the future in the end of A Wonderful Life. Tartan, my son. A little more linear than other Harvest Moon games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how. That's the word I was looking for. Thank you. So I used to find a YouTuber who loves Wonderful Life, not just Friends of Mineral Town. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, I, I really do love it. It's really good. Yeah, the atmosphere is amazing. It is it is my favorite Harvest Moon game still. Um, just it's got it's got a fraction of the content that Olive Town does, but like I just love it. The atmosphere and just the feel makes up so much of the game. And it's just it I don't even know how to describe it. Hold on, I want this. Hello, Kima! Welcome. We were talking about you earlier. I was, I was telling people about the Happy Midnight thingy. Now I want an emoji about it now. Because <laughs> you mentioned an emoji. A Wonderful Life has been purchased. Let's go! Wait, which one did you get? Did you get... Did you... Hold on, wait. <laughs> did you get it on, like, the PlayStation Store? Or did you get another Wonderful Life? Or did you get... No, I'm stuck! Go down. Did you see that? He almost destroyed me! He was, like, destroying me. Ooh, which Harvest Moon slash Story of Seasons game do you think has the strongest cast? So, here's the thing. I never played Trio of Towns. Everybody, everybody freaks out when I say that. I've never played Trio of Towns. And I hear that that game is actually the best Story of Seasons game. So, like, I don't, I don't know if I can say because I missed out on, like, one of the best. That's so wild. You got stuck. <laughs> oh, I see what you did there. Hit the mole. Okay, I can hit the mole. Here you go. <laughs> Damn. Sorry, I was just kind of letting him do whatever he wanted. <laughs> Trio of Towns is really good, but the characters were the worst part. IMO. I didn't like Trio of Towns. Oh, boy. Didn't like the majority of the cast. So, the reason I actually... One of the big reasons I skipped out on Trio of Towns is because I looked at the... I looked at the marriage candidates. I looked at all the bachelorettes and was like, eh, I don't There's no one that really catches my eye. Plus, I didn't enjoy Story of Seasons. Like, the first Story of Seasons, I didn't enjoy that game very much. Like, almost at all. So, that was also a reason why I skipped Trio of Towns. But, I do hear that's, like, really good. I, you know what? I liked, I actually really liked a New Beginnings cast. <laughs> Maybe that's because the Witch Princess was part of it. But, like, I actually really liked the New Beginnings cast. Also, I will say, the cast from A Wonderful Life and Harvest Moon DS, that cast is actually full of, like, really different, interesting, unique characters. The problem is, is they don't have enough dialogue or events in the cutscenes to, like, play off of their personality, so... It's a really interesting, different cast, but again, like the, the cutscenes and the events aren't there to like really dive into that. So hopefully a remake. You know what I'm saying? I don't like the fact that Witch Princess doesn't have a name. You know what? I've actually never thought about it. <laughs> Is that weird? I've never actually thought about that. Put this in there too. She does an animal parade. Uh, it's kind of a different witch princess, though. What about the wizard from Animal Parade? I know everybody loves the, wiz the wizard. He was cool. I, I only met him, like, briefly, but... He was actually very cool. A good A Wonderful Life remake would probably end up my <laughs> as my favorite game in the series. Me too! <laughs> Oh, please. That's all I want. All right, let's uh, let's put these in the maker here. Let's go talk to Laura. Let's see what she's doing. Yeah, okay, I'm fine with two. Whatever, I'm fine with two.
Do you like Tale of Two Towns? I do like Tale of Two Towns. I did not get married in that game, but Georgia was like one of my favorite bachelorettes of like any Harvest Moon game at that point. I really liked her. She was very cute. My mom was really athletic, though I guess that was more true during her school days. Cool. Hey. Hi. <laughs> Let's go get this thing appraised, by the way. The thing we got from the mole. The time-worn object. Grand Bazaar. That's another one I haven't played. You know what else I haven't played? I own Sunshine Islands, but I haven't played it. I, I have a... I'm having a really hard time going backwards unless it's my favorite Harvest Moon games, like 64 or A Wonderful Life or DS. I have a hard time going backwards and trying new Harvest Moon games. I see Wilder's low on HP once again. Yep, that's one HP Wilder. That's me. What's your favorite Room Factory? Mine's four, but I haven't played two, and I've barely touched three, so. I've played Tides of Destiny, Frontier, and one, and four. Um, I just, four, four is the most fun for me of those. <laughs> Although, F Frontier was fun to stream. I haven't finished that yet, but. Oh, hey, we got a whole cave pearl out of that. <clears throat> Go get pizza. Okay, I'm going to get pizza. Hold on. I gotta turn around. Room Factory looks fun. It is so much fun. If you're a fan of Story of Seasons, I recommend that you just you just get Room Factory 5. Like just just do it. I am I have a lot of confidence in just saying buy it because you'll like it. I have so much confidence in saying that. Oh, wait, she's not even open. Can I actually stay in the hotel? What's What does this do? Hi. Oh, wait, are you actually not open either? Why are you standing back here? Huh? We get... If, if the town was busier, we'd get more customers. That is fact, sir. Room Factory is a blend between Story of Seasons and Dragon Quest games. Uh, I wouldn't say Dragon Quest. Um maybe like feel but dragon quest has such a unique feel to it um i don't know what i would say as like a combination hey everybody hang out and chat what would you say if if you were to say room factory is a combination of story of seasons and blank what would you say what do you think is a good a good thing to put there i'm just i'm not gonna i'm gonna go to sleep because i can't buy the pizza and i need to get more iron before i can upgrade my hammer anyway so the hotel is a restaurant. Talk to Sally and she says it is. Yeah, yeah, I know. No, I was just wondering what, if, like, what... If I could talk to him for anything. Tails? That one's an interesting one. I haven't thought of that before. Uh... I know Tides of Destiny has a lot of problems, but I love it because the protagonists are more defined as characters. That's fair. Uh, I didn't like Tides of Destiny when I played it, but, fun fact, thanks to our new mod, Holy, uh, she's sending me her PS3, uh, which is great, and uh, I'm going to stream Tides of Destiny with all of you, and I'm going to give it a second chance, and I think I'll have a lot more fun when, uh, when I'm streaming it. Tides of Destiny doesn't let you be a girl until you hack and beat it. Yeah, it's true. That's so weird. I mean, I get it from a plot standpoint, but, like, why can't you just... I don't know. I'm gonna give Tides of Destiny a second chance, and I'll play it with everybody, and then, like, it's it's better when I play it with you guys, because, like, I can just turn around and be like, hey, what, do, what is this? Or what do I do here? And then you guys will all tell me, and then it'll, we just, like... It's just a lot more fun, because I, I get less hung up on little stuff, and I can plan ahead with your advice, so... I think it'll be a lot more fun. Yeah, the Tales of series is a series of JRPG games. Fun fact, my favorite Tales game 
is Tales of Symphonia. My favorite game of all time is Tales of Symphonia. Guess where the name Wilder comes from? <laughs> if you know Symphonia. Hello, Alexandria. Hello. Welcome. Zalos. It's true. Tales of Berseria doesn't get the love it deserves. That's because Tales of Berseria has one of like the best plots of any Tales game, and a very, very questionable battle style. <laughs> At least it's better than Zestaria. Please don't hate me for that opinion. <laughs> Please don't hate me for that opinion. No, Berseria. I beat Berseria, and it has, like, a... I, I actually really, really like the characters and story. Fun fact, I hate Zestaria. I love the I love the Zestaria... I've always said the Zestaria characters are stuck in a bad game. They're amazing characters that are stuck in a bad game. But uh, Berseria and its story and world made me want to go back to Zestaria just to play it again. Because, like, you know, I beat both of them. But it actually made me want to go back because, like, I loved it so much. I tried playing Symphonia, it broke my Steam client. Oh, yeah. The GameCube version is like the definitive version. I'm so upset that Steam port was destroyed. If you leave the egg there, does another chicken pop there? Uh, no. Um, you actually have to like, the same way that you get like a miracle potion for cows or whatever to breed them, you have to do that for chickens as well in this game. How much iron ingot do I need to upgrade? My tools to iron. Does anybody know? Is it three? Two? One? I don't know. How many is it? I forget. Three? So, Vesperia is top notch. Here's here's my thing with Vesperia, right? Uh, I love Vesperia. It's great. Uh, Yuri is the probably the best protagonist ever because like of his dynamic of him already having grown and already like having all that character development from his past and it's not about him growing it's more about how he affects other people because he's already grown and they're growing right that's the best dynamic like i, I love it so much here's the thing i have here's my big problem with vesperia it needs a really really good six hours of its story just ripped out if vesperia had like six hours of its main story just ripped it would probably be the best Tales game. <laughs> I'm not even joking. Do you like or have you played Grace's F? I have played Grace's. I have not beaten it. But uh, because I'm getting the PS3 again, I'm going to own a PS3 again, thanks to Holy. Uh, I'm going to... I'm gonna what three five five three ten. <laughs> Sorry, uh, I'm gonna play Grace's again as well. Okay, uh, then I can just go. I'm just going to the town. Hot take: Grant George was a good choice for Yuri in the Definitive Edition, even though Troy Baker should have been brought back. Yeah, that's fine. I think that's fine as well. Like I, I or sorry, I think uh, Grant was fine. I just, I feel like there are some parts where he tries to sound like uh, Troy Baker in just a, for a few lines, and it kind of, that's the only time it really takes me out of it, but overall, I just, he's fine. It's great. I went in the wrong building. Which one would be the best to start with? Here's the thing. This is, again, my opinion. Let me know what you guys think. My favorite Tales game is Symphonia. I think the Tales game that a lot of the public likes the most is Vesperia. If you take into account characters, story, gameplay, I think the best Tales game that exists today is Tales of the Abyss. If you take into account everything, I think Abyss is actually the best Tales game, even though it's not my favorite. It is a very close second, though. Orion, what? Oh, what's up, Orion? How's it going? I think I'm somehow out of you. On my personal file, I'm in Summer 11. 
But this is this is the stream file. Okay, I'm upgrading the hammer. And we're gonna go get some we're gonna go get some silver so I can get ingots out of it. TLDR Wilder, based on what you've played so far, is this game worth buying? It has problems. A lot of them can be overlooked. Some of them really can't because it's it's the problems are in the core gameplay. Know the problems first uh, before you even think about buying it. Um, but overall, I'm having fun with it anyway. This is a fun game. I'm going to be playing this game for a while. I would recommend it, but as long as you know the problems and you think they're okay, then you're going to be fine. Did you find Duke to be a meh final boss? Here's how I'll describe Duke as a final boss. Z uh, Zell and I played through Vesperia from start to finish together. And then a week later, I was talking about the, the boss battle with Duke, and Zell goes, who's Duke? And I, th I think, like, enough said. I just, I agree with that. She literally goes, who is that? And I just think that's, that's good. Where can go one go to find the problems? Um, you can probably find just about everybody talking about them wherever you go. Because I've, I've just... I've seen them everywhere. You can go to Twitter. There's just a lot of fundamentals that are... You know. Um, loving this game so far. Yeah, like, the game is fun. It's, it's a lot of fun. There are problems that hold it back quite a bit, but like, what is this picture <laughs> that you keep seeing? <laughs> but, uh, is it the crafting being slow? One of them is the makers. The makers are a big problem. Um, the frame rate is like a huge issue, especially when you start developing your farm on like a really big scale, right? It, it, beco it actually becomes like an issue past just re I want frame rate. Um, I actually thought my game was going to crash a few times on my other file. <laughs> Um, the dialogue and the characters, depending on, like, they can, be, they can be issues. They're not, the dialogue isn't the best. I've seen a lot of people complain that after you get married, the dialogue never changes from before you were married. A lot of stuff like that, you know, that just kind of mess with the, with the feel of the game. The Atelier series is great, too. Okay, so I've never played that series, but, like, my sister's a huge fan of it. I kind of want to get into it. Where should I start? Where do you think I should start if I wanted to get into it? I actually don't know, like, almost anything about it, so. No, no harvest slash cooking slash cow festivals. And you don't hunt for eggs in the egg festival. That's all true. They, they really, like, there's a lot of stuff that's been gutted from this game that are just shouldn't have been as well. Like, that's just... Do any of you know Golden Sun? I know Golden Sun. I've never played it, but I know of it. <laughs> Whoops. Bam. Get out of here, mole. I mean, baddie. You know, I can charge your hammer up? Yes, I do. I mostly kind of just do it for, like, the area of effect. But, I don't know. Yeah, let's get out of here. Let's, let's just maybe restart the, the mine. Their mine music could be mixed in, remixed into something really good. I never thought about that. Are there more of the... Did I... Oh, yeah, they're over here, right here. Anything but Rorona is a good enough start. That beat? That beat? That beat. <laughs> well, so Marvelous said that they're looking... They wanted to look into the maker problem because it was such a big thing. But they never said what they were thinking of doing, so I don't I don't know what's gonna happen. But uh, Rise has a good start, okay. But yeah, they're they want to look into the maker problem. Banjo Kazooie. I've never played Banjo Kazooie, and I really really want to.
I want to own it for my N64, but like I'm, I can't. It's so hard to find it. Like I, I prefer, I would prefer to buy it like at a local store, but my local store never has it. I mean, it's also a lot of money for, <laughs> for Banjo Kazooie, but. I'm leaving the baddie alone. He's just hanging out. <laughs> Which Harvest Moon slash Story of Seasons game would you say is the weakest in the entire franchise? That's a good question. Uh, what does everybody else think? Hold on. What, what does everyone else think? Maybe I'm forgetting about a game. Island of Happiness. Have you come across any bad stutter slash lag? Oh, yeah. Every single time, doesn't matter if it's handheld or docked, every single time I come out of the loading screen and into my farm, my frame rate is already dipped and it has to come back up. And anytime I walk past a bunch of crops or a bunch of makers, my frame rate dips. Stutters, not so much. It's more just straight up dips in frame rate. first story of seasons oh you know what <sighs> hmm tree of tranquility and animal parading tale of two towns harvest moon bazaar i think i would either say the first story of seasons might be a little too weak only because it didn't hook me at all or as much as i absolutely love it as much as as blah, blah, as much as it's like one of my favorite Harvest Moon games ever, I might actually say a new beginning only because that startup of the game can literally take some people a year to actually get the game going. Like if you don't know what you're doing and you're just super casual, super new, it can take you a very long time, and I don't think that's okay. But that game is really fun once you you know. I actually pers like I, I defend a new beginning a lot, but I will never ever defend its starting point, like its startup. I will never. I can, how can you? It's it's just it takes so long to get to a point where like everything's established. But when, once you're there, it's a really good game. You know, it's a lot of fun. There's a lot of cool mechanics, a lot of stuff introduced. But like for some people, I can see it might be it might be a problem for some people. I have heard of Coral Island. I saw it. I never made a video on it, just because I'm not super interested in it. Personally. But I'm glad everyone else is super excited about it. I do like how the game looks itself. I'm going to sleep. How can the mines lock up your game? What? How can the mines lock up your game? What happens? Can't wait to meet the Wilder YouTube and Blob Farm. I'm in. Have you guys seen Ova Magica? Do you know that I am going to be an NPC in Ova Magica? Have you seen my video? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go check out my video on Ova Magica that I made, uh, the last video I made on it. I'm going to be a, I'm going to be a, a character in Ova Magica. Claudia, who uh, is the creator of the game, she... I was talking with her quite a lot after I made my first few videos, and uh, she was like giving me information that I could use in my like uh, new video. And uh, as a birthday present, back in January, she showed me that I uh, she I gave her like 
she had access to my my chibi that I use in my stream uh, my stream thumbnails and like the outfit that he has and everything. And so she made a an NPC based off him. And you're gonna be able to you're gonna be able to battle him. You're gonna be able to battle me. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, there's the Zell just linked the video if you're interested. Already backed it for 120 cat over Magicka. I mean, nice, very cool. I'm very happy that over Magicka hit all of their, uh, all of their, um, what should I call it? Their goals, because I am actually super, super excited. I played the tech demo and like did a whole review on it, and it was a lot of fun. Pretty sure the male all of town protag is based off you too. <laughs> nah, the male, the male all of town protag was way cooler than me. Look at him. Look at him. Look at that walk. Look at this man. <laughs> He's so cool. <laughs> all right, it is time for me to make another one of these. I need more iron. I just have to make silver. That's what I need to do. Hello, Bubbles. Yeah, the develop. Yeah, Claudio's from Germany. Man, isn't so cool. Doesn't even strafe. Who, do, who doesn't strafe? Have you... You need to go to, like, every farm that you see for the rest of your life and just be like... Do you guys strafe? And they're like, yeah, of course. We're farmers. Who doesn't strafe when you're on a farm? And you're like, okay, cool. Just gotta, like, strafe check every farm. <laughs> Please don't go onto people's farms without permission. <laughs> By the way. <laughs> I'm here for a strafe check. Do you guys strafe while you farm? <laughs> oh, my God. Put in the milk. Who needs who needs peppercorn? <laughs> peppercorn. They probably have machinery for that. Does your guys' tractors do they strafe? Your guys' fet tractors strafe at all? Oh yeah, here's the candle. Whoops. That's the candle I bought. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't put a strafe button. <laughs> It's me. Here's here's a question I have. Um, for when you're like, look at this. Well, that's not a good example. Look at the candle. Look at the light. Fried chicken. Look at the light. Isn't it great? We can see now. Let's call everyone outside. Those are going. Yeah, I was gonna I was gonna ask if they They don't let you like decorate your house freely, do they? Cause it's just that little corner that I've had so far. Okay, so the dog's named Fried Chicken without an E. Only because uh Mizuru said fried chicken and Mizuru is the one that started the whole donation hype train. <laughs> So, I thought it was only fair <laughs> to name the dog fried chicken. Okay, listen. <laughs> it, uh, it makes sense if you think about it. Fried chicken. Hmm. Thursday. No, I'm fine with this. Wait, where did my... I actually put my axe away. Hold on. Hold up. No, not the leash. Yeah, I'm going to cut down... I'm going to cut down trees with the dog leash. Get some more of this. They're strafing tractors. But what about drifting? Drifting. 
when is when is story of seasons gonna add tractors that wh when are we getting tractor when are we getting when is story of seasons getting a john deere collaboration that's what i need to know these are the questions that someone should bring to marvelous when are we getting the john deere collaboration When do I get to ride a John Deere tractor? Hey, <clears throat> fun fact. You guys said you're speaking the word of God. <laughs> fun fact. Okay, listen to this. So one time, uh, did anybody? Does anybody remember those, uh, the book orders, like the scholastic book orders from schools, where you like they'd give you like the booklet with all the books you can order. You like order. Anyway, um, there were some like DS games in there right sometimes and sometimes i would like get the cheap ds games along with like a book or two or what that i wanted and i just like kind of bundled them together and my parents were like yeah okay sure we'll get you like the game and the books and i remember one of them was because i <laughs> one of them was it was a ds game i still have it i'm pretty sure it's in my ds game case it was a john deere farming game it was a john deere farming sim game and i bought it uh, with, with, like, the other books from the book order. And, like, it was actually just Harvest Moon, but, like, to do all of your, all the stuff on your farm, you had to use different John Deere machinery, like tractors and, uh, like, the, the fertilizer, fertilizer layer. Like, you, <laughs> it was, it was, it was, oh, it was just funny. I still have it. Yeah, there were DS games. Uh, one of the games that I ordered was a, uh, from the book order, was a, it was a Narnia Game Boy Advance game that I almost never played because it was not good. <laughs> I got that when I was in, like, grade three. John Deere, a farm equipment tractor company. If Story of Seasons had a John Deere product placement, I'd never play them again. Smile. <laughs> What's funny? John Deere for DS stream playthrough? <laughs> April Fool's John Deere DS stream? I'm kidding, I can't. Fun fact, April Fool's is Zell's birthday. So we're going to have like a special birthday stream. What happens if all the hearts are depleted? You pass out and you wake up the next day. We can cook ourselves now. I don't have any vegetables. I gotta plant some more. Hello, ladies. Uh -huh. well. These two hang out all the time. These two are like really good friends. Hi, Laura. Uh -huh. The acorns come up soon. I think. Wait, what do you mean you think? Ready to get your egg on? Hi there. Show me the corgi while they please. Oh yeah, sure, sure. Hold on. I'll go look at the dogs again. But what if you had a deer named John? This is true. What if we had a deer named John? You can do cooking challenges in the Rich Boy Mansion. I haven't done those yet in my other file. I've actually never cooked in my other file. I feel like I'm not ready to cook yet. <laughs> Just, my problem is I don't want to save vegetables. I want to sell them all. <laughs> That's my big problem. No, Wilder, the dogs. Not the, not the tools, not the construction. The dogs. Yeah, 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 there you go. What if you had a John named Deer? This is true. What if? Here, so these are all the dogs. We have Shiba Inus, and then we have Pomeranians, Labrador Retriever, Bernice Mountain Dog, Siberian Husky, Border Collie. Those are the dogs. I like Border Collies a lot. But I have a Labrador Retriever in my other file. And then we have the cats. 
I like the main green cat. <laughs> yeah, do you unlock more pets as you go through the game? I think I'll say goodnight for now. My ebook reader and bed are waiting for me. Thanks for making amazing content. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for hanging out with us. I hope you have a really good night. I hope you get some rest. Thanks for hanging out. Do you have any pets IRL? Uh, I, me and Zell, or Zell and I don't own any pets. But I grew up with five dogs and a cat. Not in the same house, though. I have, like, a divorced family. I grew up with five dogs and, and a cat. Now there are three dogs left. And no cat. <laughs> because they got old. Yeah, we really want a pet, though. <clears throat> I've always wanted a Labrador Retriever. Sorry. I, I've, I have always wanted a Labrador Retriever, but I, we're going to get a Golden Retriever at some point, which I'm very excited about. We just have to be in a bigger house because we're in an apartment, and it's too small for a Golden Retriever, and I wouldn't do that to the dog. That would be mean. I are... No, actually, you know what? I'm just gonna throw. I'm gonna throw all this in here. I don't need that. Actually, no, no. Give me that. Let's go. Let's go upgrade the axe. In a similar situation, but I want a husky and a cat. We have a big apartment, like actually, like a really big apartment. So I think a cat would love it here. It's just not big enough for a golden retriever. I do want a cat, though. I'm just allergic, so I'd have to... I'd have to, like, Claritin up. You know? I grew up with a cat, so I'm fine. I know what it's like. Hey. Oh, Clemens. I need an iron axe, please. Ah, uh, one iron axe, please, my dude. Thank you. All the girls are really cute in this. None of the candidates uh, are a standout in past games, but the girls are better designs than the guys. Uh, I think I agree with you. Do you want to see? Here, hold up. Oh, that's a nice. Look at this. Look at this picture. Oh, that's so pretty. I love that. I've actually taken screenshots of some of the loading screens for ideas for my own farm. Has anyone else done that yet? Yeah, dude. When you're ch when you divorce in this game, your children get Thanos snapped. They just Thanos snapped, right? They just disappear. Whoosh. They just get super Thanos snapped. So like if you if you want to marry now and then just divorce when uh later when like let's say you want to marry someone from the expansion pass, just you can marry someone now from Olive Town and once the expansion pass uh expansion comes out that you want, just divorce, your children get Thanos snapped and you can just marry whoever you want. Yeah, yeah. I even said that, like, I've been responding to comments too, being like, oh, don't worry about it. Your children just get Thanos snapped if you divorce. I, I think it's so funny. <laughs> it's great. <laughs> like a hard reset. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, you can divorce in this game. I'd rather marry them in a second save file. Yeah. It's up to you, but like, if you ever wanted to. Like, just, because I know a few people had the problem with, like, well, I'm going to have to wait to get married until, like, summer because I want to marry Ludus again. If you, if, 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 like, if you really want to, you can, if, if you like someone from all of town enough, you can marry them while you're waiting. And then just be like, yeah, I'm just waiting to divorce, you know, <laughs> just kind of waiting. Wake up every day, your spouse is like, good morning, and you're like, uh, good morning, I'm going to divorce you when Ludus gets here. <laughs> You know, it's just... <laughs> My heart can probably not handle divorce in the game. Is there a cutscene for it? Or is it actually just like, I want a divorce. And then they're like, the Harvest Sprouts are like, done. And you just go on about your day. You're just keeping the bed warm. <laughs> That's so mean. <laughs> so mean. My placeholder spouse. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god. <laughs> So what you could do, right, is if you actually marry someone from all of town and you like them, like, like the the DLC marriage candidates get here, and you're like, man, I like this character so much, though, you can just double save and then divorce. It's, like, that works, too. Or just double save before you get married, if you want. I don't know. There's a bunch of things you can do. The divorce in a wonderful life, though. <laughs> that one's rough. Oh, come on, tree. Come on. All right, fine. <laughs> they have a missing barn sign above them and you reassign them. <laughs> you, just re you just reassign them back to their own house. Yeah, has it, does anybody know if there's special dialogue when you divorce? Or is it like, is it actually just like the Harvest Sprites are like, done, enjoy your life. Hello, just got from work. Welcome. Welcome to the stream. We're talking about how the divorce system works in the game. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. The joke was like. Can you imagine if, like, you divorce and then your spouse walks around your farm with, like, the reassign symbol above their head and you just reassign them back to their own house? <laughs> that was the joke I was making. <laughs> Divorcing your spouse will basically reset your relationship with them. Goes back to the pre-love confession. However, your hearts with them will stay at 10. Okay. <clears throat> Oh, you can just marry, divorce, marry, divorce. Weird. Does anybody like the iron fences? Do they actually look good? Because they look like they would look good on the farm. Or do they look kind of like... I don't know. Do they not look as sleek as I'm thinking? I want to see a marry everyone speedrun. That would be interesting. Here, I'm going to put in the solid logs we got because we need to clear the other, the ramp. And then I'll go to bed. Oh yeah, all the sprinklers, that's right. I'm going for Neil 100%, but others have piqued my interest. If I was going to go from any for anyone from the uh, expansion pass, I think it would be Felicity. Only because I didn't marry her in a new beginning. But I liked her. <clears throat> oh, look. It's the eggs. Uh, excuse me. There's no Neil. <laughs> yeah. Check it out. Can somebody... What is this village actually used for? Do they actually give you stuff here? Because every time I talk to them, they're like, we have nothing to give you. Go away. Why you ignore me? I'm sorry, Adfaria. I actually am missing your comments. Eggs with legs. <laughs> this is where we Earth Sprites all meet up. There's lots more follower sprites hopping around these days. Is that you're doing, Wilder? Because of your hard work, our little village has gotten a lot livelier. Thanks a whole bunch. These are actually follower sprites. Hey there, Wilder. Since you've been working so hard on the farm to find follower sprites, I have a request for you. If you ever need the aid of the sprites, just let me know, okay? We'll do our best to help you out. Whenever you're ready to go back to your farm, give me a shout and I'll send you home. Eggs with legs. What do you guys think about these new sprites? I think they're kind of weird.
I don't have anything for you today. Go away. Go away. Okay, so they can actually like. Oh, can I steal their food? Can I steal their food? Can I steal? Can I steal their food? Give me their food. No. Okay. Oh, hello. Boss rights. If you'd like to release an animal, worry not. We will take good care of them here. Ah, what's lost and found? Okay. <laughs> okay. I haven't gotten any pictures of wildlife yet, no. I almost took a picture of a squirrel, but it disappeared into thin air. <laughs> How does the egg grow a beard? I do wonder. He's a manager sprite next to the, okay. So th this is just like the mineral town sprite system, yeah? Sprite coins you use. Blah, blah, blah. The sprite shop. Along with the spoils from their work, the earth sprites will also give you sprite coins. Exchange your coins for various items. Yeah, the green one is pretty cute, actually, yeah. Earth Sprite Management. Whoa. Weird. Like, pump the eggs with legs into them and they get stronger. <laughs> can I, Wait, if I confirm, can I take them out later? And then put them in somewhere else? Yes, no? Yes, okay. So they they literally just get rid of the stuff on your farm. Wait, do they do they actually get rid of the stuff on your farm and then give you the materials? Is that how it works, or is it like a mineral town type system with the harvest sprites? No, they give you things. Oh, they just get they just go out and get resources and bring them back. Oh, okay. Well, that's <laughs> just yeah. Putting all these little spread with eggs with legs in the food and the log one, it's just, just fucking fine with me, you know? So I'm going home now, bye. <laughs> you unlock more as you play, okay. I actually didn't know that. I didn't know there was a thing um, in my personal file. I'm gonna have to go back and do that. I just completely skipped over it, I guess. <gasps> fledgling drainer. We did it. We are fledgling drainer. T posing hawk. <laughs> Was it actually T posing? No, I haven't. I haven't taken pictures of like anything except my farm animals, just because they're cute. I haven't used the camera for its actual intended purpose yet. We take a picture of the butterfly. Does that count? Right here. Oh yeah, check that out. Oh, that's an awful picture. No, 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 delete that. That's a better picture. Check that out. Cool. All right. Camera hobbyist. How do you get pictures on your loading screen? Uh, mine, I, they just kind of appeared for me. But if you want your own pictures on it, you can go see Laura. Is that what everyone was saying to me? New Pokemon Snap. Zell pre-ordered it. We're going to stream it day one. We're going to stream it together on release day. Um, I think that'll be fun. To just take pictures of Pokemon together. No, I don't want to put that in. Okay. Mm. Yeah, let's go back to the mine. You have to connect to the net. The World Wide Web. WWW. <laughs> Bad name, though. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that reminded me of the new Super Mario Bros. days. Nintendo's like, new Pokemon Snap. I'm like, yeah, it's, it's definitely new. <laughs> game actually gave me anxiety a couple times because I realized just how much I had to do. <laughs> I can see that, yeah. 
I, I like having like a constant backlog of stuff to do. That's because I like grindy games. Like I, I love grinding in games. I used to sit there uh, in Pokemon when I was younger and just like grind for like chip experience all day. It was like the best thing. I'd be way too overpowered for everything I did. <laughs> It's been two hours, wanna call out the lurkers again. Hey lurkers! I love you. You're the best. It was just funny, does anyone remember were uh, were you guys here last stream or did you see the VOD? Where I asked all the lurkers to say hi because there are so many people in chat. Or sorry, there's so many people watching, but um, the chat rate was like a little slow, so I was like, I'm just curious. And I was I was like really curious, so I was just like, will people actually say hi? And they did it, it was really funny. <laughs> I loved it, it was great. The lurkers. Love the lurkers. They're the best. They're the backbone of the stream. <laughs> what have we here? A live stream? Yes, welcome. Hi, how's it going? We're playing poot. Speaking of lurkery, hi, I've been lurking for a long while now. Welcome, hi. How's it going? Oh, found it. No ladders near walls, yeah. <laughs> I'm really glad that I was told that last stream because uh, it saved me a lot of time when I was playing off screen. What do you consider the best starting Harvest Moon slash Story of Seasons to suggest someone to play? I think I would actually recommend Story of Seasons Friends of Mineral Town because Mineral Town to me the remake in in between all the story of seasons games in between story of seasons trio of towns and all of town i think mineral town was like a really nice casual return to basics farming sim so like yeah there's not a whole t like a, there's not a ton of content especially later on but like if this is your first time getting into it i would actually recommend you play mineral town the mineral town remake um i just think i think it's like just a nice, like, taste of what uh, the farming sims are at its base level, especially for this series. That's just my opinion, though. I don't know. What what does everyone else think? My first was Save the Homeland. Yeah, I bought Save the Homeland. Uh, not recently, but kind of recently. I found it for a really nice price at a uh, retro video game store. I don't know, I just think I just think Mineral Town remake is like a nice just starting point. It's just it's not super overwhelming, but you get all the basics and it is like a really fun game, good time, really nice cast, nice characters. I think it's a fun starting point that I would recommend as a starting point. Yeah, Harvest Moon DS is actually a really good one too if you have access to it. That's true. nature has the tomato festival what is the tomato festival i'd recommend mineral town remake i think i think that's my personal recommendation for a starting point because whether you go more advanced or more simple but different mineral town will will give you the idea of like 
literally you can play Mineral Town and then ask yourself, do I want to continue with more games? Yes, no. And you'd be fine, I think. Because whether you go for more advanced games like Olive Town that has a bunch of different mechanics and like a ton of stuff to do every day, like that, that like makes a backlog, or you go for something like A Wonderful Life that's more streamlined and more like story focused and linear, but makes up for it with like its its uh, like newer mechanics and like kind of like appreciating the atmosphere. I think Mineral Town is a good starting point because you can you can decide which way you want to go from that game. Again, that's just my opinion though, but like that's what I think. You have to dodge behind a barrel to avoid the tomatoes and you're on a team three, but your teammates can be heckin' dumb. Wait, I haven't played it before. That's real? <laughs> that, that sounds amazing, actually. Oh, I want the silver. Yeah, that sounds really- that does sound really fun. I feel like I might pass out. You're fine. You're fine. Keep going. I'll put the camera back in the tool bag. I love this tool bag mechanic, by the way. It is so cool. I love that you just don't have to worry about them taking up spaces in your inventory. They say the NPC dialogue is bland and dull. Kind of stop me from buying it. What do you think? Uh, so far, yeah, but I haven't seen a ton of events, and I'm I'm only in summer on my personal file, remember, so I can't, I can't be, like, the deciding factor on the dialogue right now, but so far, I mean, it's not anything crazy. Yeah, the dialogue and the heart scenes are, from what I've seen from the heart scenes, they're like, better than normal, but I want to see more of the other cutscenes with a lot of the other characters first before I make a decision on the dialogue or anything like that, you know? I just gotta play the game more. <laughs> That's all that means. Make more of this. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I can, I can, I can make, I can make, uh, I need more logs. I'm gonna make another one of these, because I want more of the... Oh, wait, did I not take the logs? I did not take the logs. That's solid logs. Hold on, do I not actually have... Are they over here? <laughs> okay, so I used up my logs. We gotta get more logs. Hold up. Hold on. Thank you. This is why we got the iron axe, see? <laughs> Marrying characters that aren't available. That's Rune Factory. <laughs> That's what I've learned. Whoops. Time to chop down every tree. And I got no room in my bag. Hold on, I gotta unload stuff. I don't know why the berries are in there, but hey, sure, why not? About to hit 200 viewers again. Yeah! If you haven't yet, hit the like button. I appreciate it. It helps me out. Thank you. Um. Yeah, no, I'll put the... I might as well keep the lumber in here. <clears throat> I need to get boxes that are, like, designated to all of the different types of materials, like ore and rock in one, and then, like, lumber and wood in the other. <clears throat> That'd be good. Okay, now we make another one of these. Let me make number three. I have to go get some cleaning to do, cooking to do. All right, thanks for hanging out. Thanks for becoming a member, too. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. 
Hope you enjoy the butterfly next to your name. And the emojis, of course. <laughs> Alright, that's going good. I need, do I need 10 of these for the, to clear the pathway up here? You know what we should do? We should make this look a little more pretty. Actually, we should move the barn over here too. That's what I'm going to focus on now. Well, after I sleep, because uh, I'm dying. I'm just dying. Wait a minute. I thought so. <laughs> I didn't even say hello to my animals today. It's because of the farm layout. Is it like it's all messy and disjointed, so like my daily routine gets messed up. Yeah, I'm, I just forgot to let them graze here. I'll just, I might as well just let them out and then go to sleep. <laughs> I'm going to clean all this up tomorrow and then, um, I'm going to clean it all up and then like move them together and hopefully that'll make me just pay attention to my daily routine more. Okay, good night. I'm going. The water bottle ran to me. Hello, right, chickens. <laughs> oh, I liked the fodder system in uh, the Mineral Town remake. That was cool. I like how that worked. Okay. I just dropped my water bottle. Oh, nice! Sick! It was open! That's awesome! We love it. Only a little bit. It was only open a little bit. So, like, it was only a little bit that came out. Oh, look! The water bottle's, like... You know, the, video. <laughs> the water bottle's, like, tilted. Like, there's, like, a... It's, like... I don't know how to say it. It's, like, slanted. The floor was hydrated. Ooh, like Stardew Valley, that's true. If grass were like Stardew Valley, that'd be cool too. Okay, let's... When can I make the sprinklers? Is there like an actual like time as to when I can make the sprinklers or no? Is it just kind of whenever? I don't want the logs. I want the solid logs. Is there something I have to do? Or like unlock it through skilling? <laughs> I have the ability to make sprinklers now. Uh, I don't have sprinklers on my list. You need the right materials? Yeah, but it, it's, it'll appear anyway, even if I don't have the right materials. I don't have it here. Is it through crop care? I just forgot, because like in my other file, it just like appeared and I was like, oh cool, sprinklers. <laughs> So like, I don't know. Okay. Then I'll just I'll just create the field over on the other side once I move everything. Uh, we're gonna throw not the egg. <laughs> we're gonna throw just about everything in here because I don't need for that. All the rocks and this. Okay. Because I want to bring out my tools so I can... Whoops. Take care of this now rather than later. <clears throat> Whoops. Look at all the eggs with legs.
you see a new type of butterfly in the third area, take a picture. Oh, it'll disappear. Really? Uh-oh. That's not good. Alright. Yeah, my farm is, like, not... Like, there's nothing... I have no crops. And, like... It's just... I need... I, I need to have it cleaned up before I can do anything and focus on anything. That's just what I've learned. So, I might as well just do it now. Leggy boys. <laughs> I have not donated any photos yet, no. I only have one photo, anyway. It's of the butterfly that we found. Alright, let me take the circle. Has it been? How long has it been since we've had a sickle in a story of Seasons Harvest Moon game? I feel like it's actually been a lot longer than I'm thinking of. Has it? Or has it not been? Why can't I remember? That's the real question. Tub them legs. Tium. But with cheese. <laughs> oh, there was a sickle in Trio Towns? Okay. So this is what I get. This is what I get for escaping Trio Towns. Every, every, everything was in Trio Towns. When are we gonna get... We're gonna get like a Skyrim crossover. Oh, Trio Towns with Skyrim crossover. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> that's, what, that's what I get for skipping Trio of Towns. <laughs> Here, the best best weapon in Room Factory Frontier is the sickle. It's true. That is ridiculous. I gotta move these makers. Play it on stream then. I don't have a way to. Give me a way to and I will definitely play it. Okay, this is good enough. Let's clear out an area. Oh my gosh. Let's put the makers over here. I don't want to use like the 3DS emulator because I'm not a fan of it. I don't want to use Citra. I just, I don't, it doesn't work well enough for me to warrant using it on stream. How much for the DS capture card thingy? I would love a DS capture card because then I could actually stream Rune Factory 2 and 3. Like we could play them together. But uh, I do not have one. That would be the best though because then we could all play the Rune Factory games. Yeah, I heard Trio of Towns was the Dark Souls of Story of Seasons. <laughs> oh, really? Wow, I mean, this is what I get for skipping St Trio of Towns. The Dark Souls of Story of Seasons. Yeah, I heard Trio of Towns actually had, like, a Crash Bandicoot uh, cameo. It was the coolest thing. He came and, like, he, he gives you Wumpa fruit, and you can grow them on your farm. Trio of Towns was sick, dude. You totally missed out. Damn, man. I love Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> you, just have some, you can grow the wumpa fruit on your farm. Mr. Capture. Oh, there's the No 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 I appreciate all that you've already given. It's okay, don't worry. Trust me, I don't even know. I actually have to look I'll look into it. I promise. And then Holy goes and drops a donate link. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pauline says that we're making her insane. Okay, I'm moving the makers over here now. Oh, per look at the perfect timing. You can call me whatever you want. But I am definitely a farmer. Look at that timing. <laughs> perfect timing. I like how you just whoop them. Uh, whoop them. I love it, it's cool. And there we go. Uh yeah, yeah, we'll put it right here. Why not? Leaves the space open for the storage box. And makes it so that they're out of the way anyway. Alright, let's go grab the these three. I'm gonna put the barn here. 
for now. Maybe we'll move the barn over. The barn and the chicken coop are going to be here next to each other. Maybe we'll move them when we have the third area open. Just because, like, uh, we'll have the space. Maybe I shouldn't have put these so close to the... Eh, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, sorry, I was going to say, maybe we'll move the barn and coop later when we get the third area unlocked and cleaned up. Just because... There's probably going to be, like, a lot more room. Plus, we, we also get the stable later, right? I don't have the stable yet in my farm. Sorry, cow. Hold on. The cow's like, where's my house? What have you done? Where am I putting it? Should we actually put it right here? Right? Yeah, beautiful. This is Mootopia. Yeah, Mootopia. Move that next to my house. How do you feel about the lack of character portraits? I'm actually pretty upset with it. I would, I said, when the game was coming out, I said I wanted character portraits, and everyone was like, "You don't need character portraits," and I was like, "Okay." And I was like, I said, "Character, like, yes, I don't need character portraits, but like." They would be pretty nice. But now that I'm actually playing all of town and I see how, like, when you talk to people, uh, they, like, you can't see their face, you can't see their model, you can't see their expressions. Why would you not want character portraits? Like, genuine question. Like, it's just, it literally just makes sense. Like, people's biggest argument were, like, well, because if the models are, are like, animated enough and I can see their expressions enough then it's not an issue but like they're not there's just they're just not like you it's like the the events are fine but like day to day like it's not it's just I don't know why they chose to is my issue there's the biggest thing with this game for me is I just don't understand a lot of the decisions they made like it's fine that they did it but I just don't understand it you know I don't know should I pull this down more would it look better if I pulled this down to kind of be level, does it matter? Oh yeah, the fodder did disappear. <laughs> Looks cool, okay, I'll just leave it then. Here, let's pull them outside. Oh, let's make a, let's make a fence. Let's make a fence, why not? Let's do it while they're out here. That's not going to be a problem. They're not going to get in the way. <laughs> yeah, if you ever want to rename your barn or coop or whatever, if you just move it, you can rename it. The white fence requires these logs. Do I have any solid logs left? Yes, I do. Log, solid log. Okay. Let's get these solid logs going because I need more of this anyway. This is looking so much better, by the way. Yeah, like a lot of the, a lot of the charm is lost from the characters, and, like, don't get me wrong. <clears throat> I understand that my. Somebody, somebody used this as an argument, too, against me. It was like, well, your favorite Harvest Moon game doesn't have character portraits. Yeah, but my wife... When you talk to characters in A Wonderful Life, it doesn't show you their back. You know what I mean? Like, the events are fine in this game because it actually shows the characters that you're talking to. But when you talk to people out of events, they either don't look at you or they look at your back. It's just you don't get to see the characters and talk to them. So, like... The models, it doesn't matter how expressive they are if they're not if they're not even gonna look at you, <laughs> you know what I mean? I just I don't understand. If you, if you if you're fine with it, then that's cool, like you're fine with it. But like I just don't understand why they did it. It's just it's just like it's a little confusing to me. Can I put this? Hmm. Sorry, bubbles. <laughs> Hold up, we're moving this again. <laughs>
There we go. Okay. Now this is kind of annoying. Now I gotta name it again. That's fine. It's not gonna woo for a while. Mootopia. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes, you can have a home. I'm sorry. <laughs> I completely forgot to put you back in the barn. And you can come outside. Mootropolis next. See, this is why you need a strafe button. You see how difficult it was for me to just, like, get into place? Like, the strafe button just would have been nice. That's all. But I got the, I got the fodder. Wait, did you... Did the fodder drop here? No, there's no fodder. Whatever, I'll just split this up and then buy more and then plant it later. No! I didn't mean to drop it all. Here, hold on. Put three in here. Iori, his cutscenes are cringe but funny. Iori seems really cool. Are his cutscenes, like, very, really interesting? Like, about his hometown, you know? From where he comes from? Like, is, is there anything like that? Because, like, I thought that would be really cool. Hold on, I'm gonna destroy this. I don't need this anymore. I don't need you. Be gone. Be gone, fodder. Remove this one too. <laughs> See, like strafing would be awesome. I don't have to keep doing this. I don't know why. There's no strafing this game. How far out should I make this? I want to plant some of the fodder seeds too. I'm gonna make gates as well. I should bring it out to the tree here, like that. Yeah, yeah, that's close enough. That's fine. That looks beautiful. Rana is really easy to befriend. Yeah, it's true. I'm marrying Rana in my main file. Yeah, I literally planted an orange tree in the spring. And then as soon as summer hit, I planted two lemon trees. Boom. That's it. That's all you need. Done. She loves you. <laughs> I'm so excited for Rune Factory 5. Like, seriously. No! Strafe. I need a strafey. Strafe or die. We said strafe or die all the way back in Frontier. Look at this. I'm dying. Because I'm not strafing. How many of these can we make? 27! <laughs> Just make them all. <laughs> Easy. How much to become an exclusive One World streaming channel? You gotta pay my rent every month. <laughs> That's what you have to do. Yeah. <laughs> Let's be honest, when I become a One World exclusive streaming channel, my rent's not gonna get paid. I need to pay my rent, you know what I'm saying? Can this come up now or one more? Yeah. Ah, that's fine, that can come up. Yeah. 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 Oops. <laughs> if I ever did a stream like that, it would be with patrons, I think. Oh yeah, why not? Why can't I place that there? Does it actually have to come out one more? Okay, let's do that then. So 
know you're torturing patrons. No, I swear. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was close enough. Or, sorry, I thought it was far away enough, but... I was not. Yeah, the chicken... I like how the chicken just... I'm locking the chicken out. Oh, do you want to come back in? Come on in. Come on in. Yeah, easy. Perfect. <laughs> Yeah, why are the fences useless? I just like how they look. But what's the utility that they should have, I guess? Yeah, you can't... I don't like that you can't attach them either. It just... It kind of just, like... They're just loose, I guess. It's not... It's not the best. There, okay. Now I have to make gates to actually get in. I don't under... I also don't understand why I can't just jump over them. Like in A Wonderful Life. You know? Just like, it'd be cool to just walk into it and you automatically jump. Yeah, they just wander at the top. So, it was funny, right? Because when I first made fences in my my personal file, I had it like a... I had them set up like next to each other, like kind of like this. And I put a fence going straight up the middle to like divide like oh the chickens play outside on this side and then the the other animals play outside on this side and the like i'm swear to god w within an hour of them being outside in the fences for the first time my alpaca just decides i don't like that i can't play with the chickens and just like 20 seconds goes up to the top and just goes to hang out with the chickens like it, it wasn't even like it just, it took no time at all it was so funny to me I just, I wish you could connect them to, like, houses, or to buildings. Yeah. Oof. Can I, make, can I make two more? Okay. I'll put one here. Yeah. yeah. And then I'll put one over here. Oh, wait, I need to put, I need to extend this a little bit more. I do like I do like customizing the farm and like building everything here like this. This is very fun to me. There we go. Okay, and then I'll put a gate here. Like, uh, where would I most likely come out of my house at? Right here. Like it? So I can just be like, yeah, that's perfect. Okay, cool. That's looking good. Yeah. Hello. Hello, fried chicken. <laughs> oh, wait. I should actually sell stuff on me. Alpacas rise up. Oh! I just meant to go sell stuff. But we got a cutscene. Ooh! I do think that's a cool cutscene. <laughs> sell this, sell this. You've unlocked the child. There are so many cutscenes in this game. Wait, someone said in my Discord, if you play your cards right, you can literally see every cutscene, almost every cutscene in the game at the same time. Pretty much, isn't that what somebody said? Does, has anybody heard about that? <laughs> Is that real? <laughs> It's like, I really want that to be real. <laughs> I, re I really want that to just walk into town constantly. Like, walk into town, cutscene, walk out, walk into town, cutscene. I really want that to be a thing. I think that would be hilarious. I triggered three cutscenes in a row without even taking ten steps into town. Yeah, like, you can just, like... <laughs> Kept getting beach events. Ma's asleep. Time to post Rat Doug. <laughs> Poor Rat Doug. Alright, now I let you out. They just trigger one after the other. <laughs> Gonna crash tonight. Good night. Thanks for hanging out with us. Hope you have a good night. 
You could definitely get a lot of them to trigger at once. I want to. I want to see that. Oh, that'd be funny. Wait, when's the when's the egg fest? Oh, it's today. Nice. Let's go get some eggs. No, not you. I meant like Easter eggs. Gotta keep this clean. Be gone, tree. Trying to grow in my field. Oh, why is this there? Hold up. Oh, it's just gonna. Oh my god. It just drops everything. <laughs> it just drops it all. Okay. That's fine. I'm gonna go with solid logs. I, I wonder how much of. Ugh, not log. I wonder how much of the, uh, the solid lumber I have now. This is kind of miscellaneous. Okay, we'll just. Uh. Hmm. You know what? This is the. This is gonna be the lumber box now. And, and the. Box and ingots. That's what this is gonna be now. I just learned it's a romantic event. How romantic is egg? Huh? You wanna kiss about egg? You weirdo. <laughs> you, wanna, <laughs> you wanna kiss about egg? That's a sentence. I never thought I'd read that sentence. Oh, I should sell the cave pearl. Why haven't I sold the cave pearl yet? This and this, this. Look at me organizing. I want the solid logs though. This. Boom. Now I gotta pick all of them. I gotta pick up all the stuff I drop on the floor. On the ground. When does the event, when does the festival start? 10 a.m.? Do they all start at 10? Give me the, give me those berries. That's a lot of grass, by the way. I need to sort command for boxes. I'd appreciate that, too. Well, there, this definitely looks better, doesn't it? I should grow grass down here. Well, at least, like, right here. I should grow some fodder. You know what? It's actually not a bad idea. I'm gonna sow that now. Even though I don't have the seeds. I should grow it, like, right down here. Yeah, why not? I'll just do the. I, I'll I'll do this, and then later on we can put a sprinkler in the middle when we unlock sprinklers. Okay, so now that this is done here, I think this second area over here is going to be where my crops grow. I should probably take care of this now. Well, hold. On, let's go to the egg festival first. The egg festival. Missouri, welcome to custom emojis. Zell told me to join. <laughs> Hi, welcome. I hope you enjoy your butterfly badge and your custom emojis. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate it. All right, let's go. Let's go find some eggs, shall we? I follow directions. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Enjoy your emojis. The witch princess lol emoji looks so good on YouTube. I'm so glad. Zell said, "Capital D colon." Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to declare our annual spring egg hunt open. Yay, yay. Eggs are hidden all over town, so keep your eyes peeled and search away. There is but one rule. Have fun and play fair. That's two, Victor. That's two rules. You said and. That's two, you liar. Now then, I'll be commencing the festivities shortly, so take this time to prepare yourselves for the most excellent event of the year. Excellent. Damn, capital D colon? Strong words. 
Yay, yay. <laughs> the Egg Hunt is a local festival where everyone in town searches for eggs that are said to bring happiness to those who find them. If you're close with someone, you can ask them to look for eggs together with you. If you prefer to hunt alone, that's okay too. Just talk to Victor to get things started. Alright, I'm going. Look at how cute this is. Look at my frame rate drop. I love it's so cute. I love it. Look at the fanners. <laughs> okay, I'm kidding. I'm just being mean, I'm sorry. I get to talk to everyone here now though. Guess I'll look around too. Stupid egg. I don't even like eggs. Eggs suck. I just I wanna go home. It's okay, Damon. It's alright. I wonder how many eggs we'll be able to find. I should just talk to everyone. This is like the best like opportunity to just put friendship up, right? Like this is awesome. Jacobo adores the egg hunt. He may get a little too carried away if you ask me. The Switch can play Skyrim. <laughs> also the Switch. There were more than three banners, so I'm gonna drop 60,000 frames. <laughs> Sorry, 600,000 frames. This is one of Cindy's favorite festivals. She's been bouncing off the walls since early morning. Jack was giving me tips for finding eggs. Oh, I... Because of that dialogue, I expected Cindy's dialogue to be a little more, you know. My egg senses are super sharp. Figured the least I could do was throw Cindy a bone with a few hints. Hello there, and you are? You're... Oh my god, I haven't talked to her yet. <laughs> it's nice to meet you. I like the egg festival too. And I think of it, you do look quite a bit like your grandfather. Yeah, thank you. Sorry I haven't met you yet. Gloria painted all the eggs. Pretty intricate, don't you think? Okay. Why are you... I know exactly why you're on the swing. You want a picture taken, don't you? Don't worry, I got you. Oh, the frame rate. Okay, let's 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 do it. Let's do it like this. Yeah. Perfect. And as you can see here, this picture just shows a great deal of that melancholic feeling we get during spring. Got it. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> All right. Let's stop bullying the local people now. <laughs> I've heard of you. You moved. Oh, okay. I am so sorry I don't talk to you people on stream. Eggs of joy, huh? <laughs> kind of like it. Really? Look at this. It's Lars and Beth, the two that are breaking hearts. I'm so sorry I don't talk to you people. I see everyone else having so much fun. I can't help but get into it myself. Those eggs really are stuffed with happiness. I'm gonna find as many as I can. For Beth's sake. Aw, oh, stop being cute. Aw, aw. Everyone wants to date both of you individually. <laughs> it's true. A little old to be hunting for eggs all on my own, so I reckon. Rushing in headlong isn't always a vi valid strategy. I advise taking a more measured approach. Ralph looked so much taller. Like in the cutscenes in the trailers, didn't he? I mean, he's still tall, but like, I don't know. <laughs> oh, hey, Laura. Mm -hmm. The early bird gets the egg. Uh, I don't think so. That's not the right word. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Oh my god, okay, I'm so. I'm, let's just get out of the way. Let's get out of the way. It's just, yep, nice to meet everyone. Nice to meet everyone. Hi, I'm new here. Hi. Sure. Telling Raul the trick to finding eggs. I'm really good at finding shells on the beach, so finding eggs shouldn't be that different. Okay, nice to meet you. You can talk to you again. <laughs> you cannot, in fact, date Beth. Yeah, it's true. Lars got all the personality. Mm -hmm. Hi, Blair. Nice eyes. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. It's time to egg. <laughs> you can't kill me. I'm vital to the plot. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone like that from the last stream? Look at me go. Why couldn't I look for the eggs myself? I would actually, wouldn't it be cool? Like, run around and find the eggs? <clears throat> like, you get a timer on screen? And, like, whoever finds the most eggs wins. You know? And every year it gets harder. Like, the eggs are hidden a little better. And the NPCs get smarter. I think that would just be cool. We love to watch egg cutscene. <laughs> How do you not notice an egg that big right away? 
they blend in really well. The green egg blended in really well with the blue carpet. <laughs> I found three. Gracious, Simon and I only found one. It said the number of eggs you find represents your happiness. Those of you who found no eggs, you will be depressed for the rest of your life. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Happy Egg Festival, everybody. I love this town. <laughs> Yay, depression. That includes our annual egg hunt. <laughs> At the base of a slide? Yeah, really. <laughs> My grandparents, when I was younger, would hide eggs, like, all around their town for Easter. And we would find, like, like uh, some days later, we'd just, I'd just be like, hey, there's, like, a chocolate egg on the windowsill, and it's, like, melted. And my grandparents were like, oh, no, we forgot about that one. Like, we have to clean it up and, like... <laughs> it was just that. I don't know why that reminded me of that, but... This is funny. If you didn't find an egg, you will die in seven days. <laughs> <laughs> if you didn't find an egg, you will automatically be transferred into The World Ends With You. You will play the game. Make sure you find those eggs. It's fun. <laughs> Horror moon. <laughs> Hello, fried chicken. You know what, I still got some time left. The night is young. Let's start this now. Let's get a head start on cleaning this up. That might make the plot more interesting. <laughs> the textile maker. Very cool. Thoughts on the game so far? I'm having fun with it. I'm gonna be playing this for a long time. Um, like, I just, it's just the, the I, like, I'm really enjoying it, but, uh, it definitely has its problems, and some of them are very, very apparent, but overall, I just, I really enjoy it. It's nice. I especially like this, like, taking care of my farm and decorating it is probably, like, one of my favorite parts. Oh, you're right, thank you, I forgot about Town Hall. Hold on, we'll head up to Town Hall tomorrow. I completely forgot about my rewards again. Already. Color me impressed. What's up, Sir Turtle? How's it going? Can I make a pathway? I think I'm gonna make the pathway out of stone. I like how the stone pathways look a lot. <clears throat> Boom, perfect. I did not refill the fodder only because um, I need to go buy more plus the seeds. They'll be fine for today. More of these. How much solid lumber do I have now? I need to go to the mines again. 24. Did I need 30? Or was it crazier, crazier than that? Just throwing this in here. Throw it in. Uh, okay. Oh, wait, let me grab the rocks so I can actually make the pathways. Or the, st sorry, the stones. I just think these roads are really cool. Let's make all of them right now. 55, go. Zell is a fan of Attack on Titan. I am going to start watching it very soon. I've watched the first season, of course, like when it was super popular, like years ago. But uh, I, I plan to rewatch it and then watch the rest very soon. But Zell is a huge fan.
Yep, road it up. Yep, I, I heard that uh, stuff won't spawn where you put roads, so. Putting them down. But yeah, Zelda the manga. <laughs> it can't be placed here. It can't be placed here. Does anybody else ha hate that the giant clear away is above your head while you walk over your roads? Is that just me? Is it like a little, just a little pet peeve, or is it like actually kind of annoying? <laughs> Okay, we'll go buy some spring seeds tomorrow. Plant them here along with the fodder seeds. Yeah, I don't know any spoilers. So, uh, I'm pretty excited. But, uh... It, even if I knew spoilers, I'm so bad. Like, my memory is so bad that I, for, I just... <laughs> forget them anyway. <laughs> That's why I have to rewatch the first season. You know? Oh, I just hit my keyboard. We're good, we're good. Cool, stream's still up. Cool, awesome. We're going. Spoilers. Some people attack. <laughs> uh, and I'll do... Cool. Here, I'm going to stop here for now, because it is midnight, and then I'm going to buy the seeds tomorrow. Cool, that works out well. And then we'll get the sprinklers and just put the sprinkler in the middle. <gasps> An onion! Yeah, my character does need to sleep. I'm going right now. Who needs berries? An onion. Such a dramatic onion. It's Pikmin! Yeah, it... I've increased my stamina a bit in my other file. Um, it has stuff to do with the... As everyone was calling them, eggs with legs. <laughs> oh, wait! Thank you for reminding me. I gotta go back to the Sprite Village to actually collect all my stuff. Hey, can you take me to the village, please? Okay, so who took this picture, huh? Which one of y'all took that picture, huh? I have something for you. Whoa. Cool, hold on, let's go. Look at them, look at the eggs, little run around. <laughs> Hi. Can I go to the sprite shop? What kind of stuff is here? Oh. Okay. Cherries. Cool. Um, so is this like how... Do you get like a ton of metals? If you just like load them all up into the same... Thingy? Oh, look at everyone over here. Wow. How'd you move the barn? You just go up to the barn and press B. And you can uh, pick it up and place it back down and rename it why does everybody have stuff for me now hold on let me sprite management i didn't put anything into these two but they have stuff for me does it do they just it's just like automatic how does that work i'm gonna keep putting sprites into this one <laughs> the log one there we go okay bye <laughs> Every heckin' day. Oh, look at the sleeping chicken. That one's cute. I skipped him in his log goods? What? Did I not? I thought I talked to him. He just gave me medals. <laughs> that, this is a beautiful picture, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, like literally Huh? 
Look at them all run around. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I already talked to him. I mean, I, he just gave me medals. Hold on, I'm gonna go back. I gotta go buy seeds now. Oh, I haven't watched Spirited Away. What's up? How's it going? Welcome to the stream. I haven't watched Spirited Away. It was me who was the soft boiled egg. One of the best movies. Yeah, I know. I really need to watch it. I've watched Howl's Moving Castle. Yeah, that's the only one I've watched. Howl's Moving Castle. So I could actually marathon them. Open the gate. Okay, let's go by seas now. Nino Kuni. I started playing Nino Kuni on my PS5. It's a very pretty game. Ponyo. Mr. Drippy. I love Drippy too. He's great. Uh, let me put some stuff away so we can actually carry all these seeds. Why do I not sell stuff? I don't know. I'm not sure. I had one thing on my mind. It was get the seeds. <laughs> oh, why are you here, Lou? Hi. <laughs> One's like, why do you have a scythe? I don't think you're allowed a scythe in the store. <laughs> all right. <clears throat> We'll do something easy. We'll do something easy, like turnips. Something renewable, like uh, cucumbers. And then we'll grab the fodder seeds. Oh, boy. Looks like we're out of money. Cool. All right. Thank you for the money that I don't have. Thank you. <laughs> let's go Let's go check the, uh, uh, the town hall. <laughs> Yeah, check this out. Oh, my bag's full. Hold on. <laughs> if to be fair, it has been a while since I've been here. Oh, we should go get this stuff. Uh... Hold on, let's go, let's go over to Reina first. Just to see if we can stack any stuff with it. Maybe I'll actually come back. It's my birthday on the 25th. I marathon a bunch of Julie movies. How is Wing Castle still my favorite? Happy late birthday, yeah. I hate that this is one at a time. This being one at a time kind of reminds me of Animal Crossing, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh. oh, you're right, the butterfly picture. Do I, right here? I have a picture of a butterfly. I have a picture. This one, right here. White butterfly. So is this like an actual art gallery or? Oh, weird, what? <laughs> what? We will use this photo as a reference to craft a new sculpture. So please come to see it once it's complete. Oh, they're building a sculpture. The sculpture is currently being made. Oh, very cool. Okay. Nice. Oh, what's up? Look, it's the dudes. Now the egg hunt's over. Maybe the town can get back to normal. Whoa, okay. Damon, I'm sorry, man. I had fun. So, are you feeling like the festival of happiness yet, or what? 
anybody who uh like wanted to marry damon at first are there any of you that wanted to but then met lars and like kind of got like i don't know like sad <laughs> I think Damon's cool, but, like, I can imagine some people just kind of being like, man, Lars is, like, what I wanted Damon to be. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. That sucks. All right, let's, let's just dump all this stuff in here now. And then I will put stuff back in here. No, 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 no. I need that. I don't want that right now. 27 solid lumber. Okay. Damon's just Neil done worse. Never wanted him. <laughs> rough. <laughs> that was rough. Oh, right. I cannot charge it yet. F. <laughs> Damon just got murdered. F. I'm very interested to see Neil again because I haven't played a new beginning for quite a long time. And so I kind of just want to talk to Neil again, but I want to see how he's going to be done in this game. You know what's going to be really weird? Seeing characters like Neil and Felicity from past games without their 3D portraits. Or sorry, their two sorry, without their 2D portraits. That's going to be really weird to me, I think. I don't know. I didn't know you couldn't date Lars until I started watching your videos. Haven't played too much. Oh, that's okay. Yeah. Beth is another popular one. They're dating, so I think... I actually think Marvel's new about that one. I think they're like, oh, everyone's going to want to marry them. Let's just have them date. <laughs> My little angie cowboy. <laughs> I like Neil too. He was he was my friend. Do you think they're actually gonna implement portraits in the update? I'm not gonna lie, I would actually really like that. That'd be cool. I thought Neil would actually be really sweet like Ford, but nope. Yeah, Neil... Has anybody gotten, like, really far into Neil's, um, hard events? Does he, like, show his personality more? Does he, like, open up at all? Or is it just done in a way where it's, like, he barely does and then he's back to normal once the event's over? <clears throat> I'm curious about that one, actually. Sorry, I meant Damon. I'm so sorry. I meant to say Damon, <laughs> not Neil. Is there, is like, Damon, does Damon have the, in his heart events later on, does he like open up? Or is it like actually, or is it just done kind of half, half heartedly? Sorry, I, I, <laughs> I meant to say Damon. Damon goes back to hay. <laughs> I don't know why that was so funny to me. Just shipping the two berries. Here, let's go back and check up on the obstruction in the way, and I want to see. I want to see what I need again because I forgot. Oh, I'll get this in one way too. Nice. Ralph is low key kind of boring, but that's why I like him. <laughs> Iori unlocks 
another character. Okay, so wh what is it with that that I've been hearing? I need 50 solid lumber. Okay, that's fine. Everybody's been saying that you have to, like... What do you have to do? Ralph is bland milk. <laughs> Wait. Is well milk bland? Like a... What are you talking like... You have to marry him, and then it's like another character that comes in, is what everyone's saying? Huh, okay. What happens if you marry him and then divorce? Does the character stay, or do they get final snap too? <laughs> okay, I think... I'm happy with how those are laid out, the, uh, the fields so far. <clears throat> I need, I need 50 of solid lumber, huh? I have 30. Should probably just make another one of these, I guess, yeah. Might make it go faster. More makers! Look at me go! Many much makers. Cool. Let's go chop down some more trees. Let's go pioneer some of Olive Town. If you see his cutscenes, there's a ninja trying to assassinate Yori. What? Are you serious? That sounds so interesting. Is it actually, like, super interesting? What? Let's go pioneer more of all of town. <laughs> yep. <laughs> That's me. Look at me go. Oops. Stop. <laughs> the character's just swinging at the air. I'm farming. Oh, perfect. Three in a row. Let's do it. I was badass about it. <laughs> My stomach is starting to growl very loudly. What should I eat? <laughs> Mizuru says, eat a burger. Zeno says, choose egg. <laughs> you have lots of options. Why don't you put an egg on your burger? Boom. Boom. No more egg. Too romantic. <laughs> egg too romantic. No more. Please. If you eat egg, you will have to do a kiss. <laughs> no more egg. <laughs> Eggs on burgers are delicious. I don't have eggs on burgers too often. But when I do, they're pretty delicious. I must say. <laughs> it's him. He's on my loading screen again. I'm going to let the dog sleep. Pasta for breakfast sounds like a good much. Someone took a picture of an alpaca floating above the water. Why don't I get those little loading screens? I get loading. I, I get just loading screens of pictures of the, the like the gourmet guy, just looking at me weirdly. Why can't I get floating alpacas? <laughs> Oh, 
They do have different festivals in this game, but a lot of the old ones, like cooking festivals or like like cow festivals where they rate your animals, are missing. Um, they have one romantic festival, where it's a cutscene, and one minigame festival where you play it uh, a, mo a, a season, like a month. So, um, yeah, that's what they have. For this way, I can pick this up. I gotta empty my bag again. Time to compromise. I'll have some mac and cheese. Enjoy your mac and cheese. Oh wait, I'll put the flowers in this one. <clears throat> for this, yeah, for this. Let me put all the food and ingredients in the in the bin. Check that out. Look at me go storing ingredients the way they were meant to be stored. Outside. Perfect, okay. Oh my gosh, wait, hold on, hold on. I completely forgot that, like, the whole reason I came back here to sell stuff was so that I could get the rest of my ingredients, or my, uh, rewards. Look, it's Yori. They give you different prizes for festivals. Like, sometimes in the old games, we would get recipes f uh, to make stuff as a reward. The only festival I've won... And like done so far is the uh, the pet racing festival, and for that they gave me a trophy for my house and five thousand G. That's all I got from that one. Can anyone else confirm what if you get any like unique rewards from festivals, like mini game festivals? Look at all the, look at all this stuff. Egg table. My bag's full. Okay. I'm trying to do the pet festival. The pet festival is fun. I got a gold trophy for my house. That was great. So many coins. I'm selling them. I'm going to sell them. I've seen a lot of trophies, so I think that's what you get. Okay. Yeah. Sounds like it's just going to be trophies. I mean, having a collection of trophies ain't that bad, you know? But, uh, yeah. 18 Bronze Town Medals and 3 Silver Town Medals. Plus they gave me a bunch of Makers, which is nice. The game knew. The game knew. See, they know. Here's your Maker. Put your solid log in it. There you go. Enjoy your day. While we make you one piece of lumber. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't mean to be mean to the game. I don't... I like... <laughs> just... That was funny. <laughs> Cool, now I also have the... I can make mayonnaise now, too. I'm actually really glad they... Oh, whoops. I'm actually really glad they gave me more makers, because... Those will go by a lot faster. Mayonnaise! Hold on, I gotta take this tree out. Or these trees. Even the game's trying to donate to Wilder's stream with all the coins. <laughs> Man, if you don't check the rewards for a while, like, like I'm gonna get like a lot of money from the coins that I just sold. So, oh look, pet treats! I forgot. Let's go feed one to fried chicken. <laughs> Make some mayonnaise. Sorry, I was reading chat. I didn't know where my door was. <laughs> Hello, fried chicken. You want some treats? Here, have this. Cool. Yeah, like, this kind of sucks. I can't, like, decorate my house. I have to put them in the corner over here. The game's like, you're not going to decorate this properly. You're going to make it look ugly, so you can make this corner look ugly, but the rest of the house, just don't touch it. It looks pretty enough, okay? I'm like, oh, okay, I'm sorry. 
who just has habaneros lying around. Oh, I should I should move my I should move the well over now that my crops are over here. Check it out, my farm's actually looking pretty nice now. I got the makers tucked away in the corner. This is actually looking pretty good. This is pretty cool. And boom. There, I need the hammer though. Oh. I didn't know George Lu <laughs> I didn't know George Lucas designed this game. <laughs> that's an underrated joke. Oh, that's an underrated joke you just made. Oh, I love that. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> that was so good. <laughs> I can't pay attention to anything for three hours. Now I'm sleepy. Wow, I have been streaming for three almost three hours and fifteen minutes. And there's still 175 of you here. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. The chat rate is 6, by the way. <laughs> there's so many lurkers. <gasps> Area sewing, let's go! We're a farmer! Oh, sprinklers. They're here. We got it. I need to take a nap, but I can't turn myself away from your amazing content. Oh, thank you so much. You're so nice. I appreciate it. How do you feel about the materials? Auto spawning on the farm? Kind of hate. Kind of love it. Well, it's nice because, like, you need so many materials. Like, constantly. You, you actually need to just keep doing what I'm doing right now. Like this with the makers. So, like, it's nice that they come back so fast. But at the same time, like, if you don't take care of them right away... It's so messy. Like, even though I'm starting to put paths down, there's going to always be trees growing in areas I don't have paths in. Like this over here, right? Like, look at how messy this is getting now, just on the corner. Right? Like, it's... It is a blessing and a curse, you know? Let a soothing voice lull you to sleep. <laughs> I've been sleeping to the AWO playlist. Oh, really? Now she's sleep to the the Let's Play. Mushrooms is bank money. Yeah, is that true? Everybody's been saying mushrooms is where you get all the money. Yeah, I need to go get mushrooms, or I have to fix the log. Did I hear three hours? Everyone drink water. Oh, I gotta drink my water. Hold on. Ah. Water. What your body needs to live. <laughs> Thank you for reminding me. <laughs> that's, my, that's my Mentos the Fresh Maker commercial, by the way. The mushrooms in the third area? Ooh, look, like the mushrooms that grow there or the mushrooms that you can grow there? Is the ones that grow there? <laughs> Sal's laughing at me. <laughs> uh, that's good for now. Cool, look at it. We got the maker farm. We got the animal farm. Then over on the other side, we got the crop farm. We're going good. See, but like, this is what I was just talking about, right? Look at how messy this is getting in here, right? Like, now I gotta take care of all this, I gotta get the grass out of the way, I gotta stop the trees from growing. Actually, you know what? Having one tree right here might actually be pretty cute. I'm gonna leave that one there. But this one has to go. This one has to leave. It's nice for the resources. Like, so, because, like, I remember in Mineral Town, in the Mineral Town remake, I was having a really hard time getting enough wood to make... A lot of the stuff I wanted because I was have to, having to wait for it to grow back because I was like I was like destroying all of it like 
every time it showed up because I needed it to come back and I needed more of it. Um, so like this is nice because I'm, I'm never running out of like trees to cut down. But uh, they, they can come back real fast. Okay. I guess now I should go get more silver because I need more of these ingots. I don't know how many I have in the box left, so I'll just grab a few of these. Wow, that was a lot of iron ore. <laughs> And away with ya. Away with ya. Oops. Strafe, please. I need a strafe key. What is what does ZR and ZL do in this game? Like if you're not in your inventory. Can that not be strafe? Can I not have like the strafe key? Is it, is it, can I not? Oh that was cool. Well bam! <laughs> yeah, they should have let us build with raw materials. I think I think a lot of that issue could be solved with just letting us use the raw materials, you know. The makers would be fine if I could stack them like Minecraft. <laughs> like, let, me, let me Minecraft stack them, you know? I want to play Minecraft. <laughs> Mining looks so fun. Mining's alright, yeah. You know what I miss? I miss mining from Magical Melody. Magical Melody had like, because with the, like, the crystals that have all the weird random effects, I thought that was really cool. Minecraft stream. <laughs> You could stack in trio of towns. Yeah, so like why can't I stack here? It's so it just confuses me is all. Like, more than anything, it just conf it's just confusing, you know? Magical melody was rad. I miss fainting in magical melody. <laughs> what? Can you elaborate with what? What do you mean? I need to stream magical melody one day. I have barely played that game, but I love it so much. If I stream it, then I commit to it, you know? Yeah, yeah, Magical, or Magical, uh, Animal Parade and Trio Tranquility, too, had those, those, uh, like the mining mechanics. Like, they all just kind of shared them. Those mines were awesome. This one's pretty fine, though. It's all right. Yeah, I own the GameCube version. I, I know about the Wii version. <laughs> no, let me. Uh, I got stuck on the stairs. Can I can I break this without dying? Totally, totally. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, it's fine. We did it. For one iron ore, one HP Wilder. Here we are. I need a one HP Wilder emoji for for members. That's what needs to be the next emoji. What, I need. what do you what do you guys think? That'd be nice to spam. <laughs> there we go. This now I can put these in here. 43, we're almost there. We're slow on these makers though, which is why I went in the mine. Now that I've got like my dedicated crop area. Well, should I? Here's here, what should I do first? Should I open up the third area first, or should I make the sprinklers first? Because I need the iron or the silver ore to do both. Should I make the sprinklers first? That way we get more money overall. I mean, I can just water it until my skill goes up, right? Maybe I should just open the third one. Look at all the hearts, <laughs> the damaged hearts. One HP is just called efficiency. Yeah, I should upgrade my watering can. <clears throat> Hello, Poppy. Hi. Here, have a treat. No, wait. Did I already give you a treat today? 
I'm sorry. Okay, I'll give you a treat tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I know. I need to water by hand more for the skill. Look at all the money we got. Look at the town. 1,800 and 1,500 just from these medals alone. <laughs> Oh my gosh. That's awesome. Yes, it's very nice that you don't have to lose your tools for a few days to upgrade them. I love that change. That is actually really good. I get why, like, yeah, we have lost them before. But, like, man, it's so nice to not, you know? Eighth? Eighth? file so I don't actually save for my main file cool okay all right well then uh, that's gonna be it for the stream I'm actually gonna I'm gonna end it here that was th almost three and a half hours this was super fun anyway thank you all so much for watching I really do appreciate it and thank you so much for all the donations and the members if you haven't yet join the discord I have a Discord where we just can just chat, you know, and hang out. I appreciate every one of you so much. Like, thank you so much for uh, everything. Even just for just watching. Even if you were lurking. Thank you for being a lurker. Love you all. But yeah, um, I don't know when the next stream's going to be. Hopefully soon again. I'll, I'll Like always, I'll put it in the announcements channel in my Discord. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you next time. Have fun with Olive Town uh, while I'm gone. Bye-bye.